back in blue check. To answer that question is yes, yes, we are good, good, good. Hello everyone! Welcome back to Digimon Reality, session 19, rebuild the future. Um, this is of course session 19 of the ongoing series, Digimon Reality, so I'm excited to get started. I know we didn't play last week, but um, it's because we had some stuff pop up and happen, but that's okay, because we're here this week to bring you another digital adventure filled with fun and Digimon. You know, all that good old jazz. Um, currently, though, I got to do some moving around of things because everyone is in the same locale. And let me just let me just do this over here. Just you know, while I'm doing this, Amy. <laughs> You can uh, go ahead and do your uh, <coughs> recap for what happened last mm. time we played. Okay. Previously on Digimon Reality. So my whole life just kind of got turned around since I met these new tamers who are, let's say, pretty weird. Right after I met them, we fought like a bajillion Digimon. One of them jumped in a, in a freaking fountain. <laughs> and let me tell you, Fighting giant Digimon is really scary, and I do not recommend it. We then started to pack our things to go somewhere. I don't really know where we're going yet, but we have to go find the rest of the Tamer's friends first. One of them is apparently a pizza guy? Uh, we were hot on his pizza trail, when suddenly we had to fight a Dromojimon that almost killed Thaddeus, and I barely saved him. He's now unconscious. And two more Digimon appeared. Oh boy, I'm gonna need therapy after this. Yeah, that was a good one. <laughs> I like it. Hello, Iris. <laughs> All right. I, I'm, I am. I am here. I, I realized I had my headset, so I could just you know be quietly listening while I'm otherwise indisposed. Welcome, Dad. And that was who is asleep. That was a solid intro. I thought it was a good intro too. I'm very glad. So yes, that's that, that is exactly what happened last time. We had some people uh, pass out. We fought against a bunch of Digimon, and now two new Digimon: Dokugamon and Parrotmon have now uh, appeared for me. Digital Gate. But that's not entirely where we're going to start today's story, right? Uh... Let's, um... Uh... Ray, since you're back, roll me a D... Four. You don't even have your character selected. <laughs> That's because I wasn't here yet. But you are here. But I wasn't. Look. <laughs> but, but you're here. You're, you, you, you are. I don't know where exactly I am. All right. <laughs> you're exactly where. I put you. Alright, back to the basement. Got it. Yeah. One second. Alright, so. Um. Four, huh? Big old four. I, I do actually need you to select your character so I can put. Mm -hmm. Poor, poor you, with your, uh, not having, um, not having your partner. 
So. I mean, I don't know what you're talking about. You know, that, that's just some weird dream. All right. Mm-hmm. So you wake up. We're over in here. Just anywhere. Yep. You, you wake up over in here. You've been chilling at a friend's house. Or friend's house. Um, for a while. But you, you had gone to work, right? Before everything. You had gone to work. Um, you had already made a, 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 a delivery. And you had really only stopped by this person's house to pick up a few things um you wake up right uh because you're still on shift technically but you you wake up having fall having fallen asleep on the couch or having fell asleep on the couch for an unknown amount of time i mean that's normal So that's just normal. <laughs> I mean, eh. I mean, I'm saying you literally just woke up. It's okay to wake up and. So you're saying this is the place I've been crashing? At least for now. I'm gonna get up. Already. At some point, gonna try to like look at the time on, I guess the microwave or something. All right. If that's even set right. Um. You you look at it and it says uh. After waking up, it you notice that it says it's two thirty eight. Gotcha. Thirty-eight. Yep. Okay. Don't remember when I fell asleep, so. Yeah. <laughs> yep. But you so, do. You go ahead and roll me a a history check. Okay. So um, whose place am I at? Uh, it's a guy by the name of Kevin. That's funny. You don't know a last name, just Kevin. No, I, I think, think it seems funny because I was about to say, like, I was about to say Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Just That's just the name, Kevin. That's all you know about him. But that, that that's the place. But um, what the role is for is that you do remember you have least two more deliveries to make. Uh, Which wait, at this wait, do, do, do I have the pizzas with me? Uh, they're, they're, uh, they're still with your vehicle. Sorry, whoever getting these pizzas, they're going to be cold by the time I get there. And before I go down, I'm look in the fridge for something to drink what type of person is kevin um is, do i open the fridge and it's a pretty it's actually a pretty sparse fridge you um, you're not sure if it's uh, just because you know kevin doesn't get stuff or because you've uh taken everything that was in the fridge see at first i didn't know if kevin was one of those like real nice guys or if he was just gonna be another another let's just say bro yeah, all right. So what is it? where am I? Is this like a college dorm I'm in, or is this like an apartment? Um, this is, it's an apartment complex. It is most commonly used by, you know, a lot of the 
the students that go to the school um, to the school but um, currently you're just at someone's apartment well I'll grab whatever there is to drink in the fridge you find a single cola I'll take this uh, I'll take Kevin's last cola okay you take Kevin's last cola I'll jot down an IOU on a piece of on a sticky note just <laughs> <laughs> okay. So you take his last cola, you go outside, you know. Um you look around for a minute and but you eventually you find your vehicle. Alright. This real beat up, almost look like almost looks like it's barely holding itself together. Look, it does just fine. All moped. Right. You see the pizzas are like uh, bungee corded to the the backs. Yeah, there's rack. like one of those. Yeah, there's one of those little racks that is added on to it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all right. Look, it works just fine. It gets me from place A to B, and then I'll have you know, it has never done me wrong. All right. So you're not sure where your deliveries were, but you do know that your phone would have them. So I'm like sitting there on the on the on the moped, just gonna start feeling around my pockets, like my jacket pockets. And... Don't find anything. Let's see, I'm gonna look at the pizza boxes. Look at the receipts on the pizza boxes, because I I don't want to go back there and tell it say, hey, I forgot where I'm going. <laughs> All right, so you look on the receipts. You know the city pretty well. Um, you do know that uh, one of the pizzas is gonna be delivered over in this area. You're not entirely sure precisely where. And that the other pizza is over. I'm going to be heading to the one more towards the south since there's only one way to get across the river. There's two ways, but they're both on the same side of the city. Mm -hmm. Alright, so you, you know, of course head that way. It takes you about 10 minutes, but you get over here. And once you're closer, you're able to, you know, discern which roads you need to, get to take. Like what turns in order to get to where you're going. Um... You find the the building uh, over in here. As you go to it, you know um, it's a place of business. They seem to have ordered a pizza or something. Um, you kind of you look at it. And you notice that it says uh, Jeffrey Dahmer is the the person who put in the order. Squeeze me. I said Jeffrey Dahmer. Anywho, so it's like it's a business or something. Yeah. Like what? What type of business? Is like you talking uh, uh, receptionist business or is it like? Yeah, it's it's it. There's a receptionist there. Okay. And looking at the receipt, did they already pay for the pizza or is it like I'm getting cash? Yeah, they already paid. They paid with gold. Alrighty, you know, I'll go up in there, you know, with the pizza. I'll go up to whatever desk there is. Uh, as you walk in, you know, and you're bringing the pizza, the lady goes, Oh, yes, thank you. I, I, I'll be happy to sign for that. Yeah, if you could sign here. And she signs. She, she writes, uh, hold on. Uh, 
a one dollar tip um she does that and then uh she she just kind of grabs the pizza nods and thanks you and uh, seemingly walks away to go hand it to somebody You're lucky you got away. <laughs> so you get over here. Uh, oh, what size pizza was this? Uh, it's a medium. Look, we already clarified a one, uh, one, one topping pizza is like twenty six bucks. All right. Mm hmm. Could they have given me at least you know two bucks? <laughs> round, round it up to thirty bucks, you know. So over here is actually a. Uh, an apartment complex. The whole way I'm driving over here, I'm just a whole, <laughs> thinking about that $1 tip. <laughs> How am I supposed to pay for anything with dollar, get dollar tips? So, but you get here. Uh, these people, um, they did not pay in cash. Or they did not pay in card, they paid in cash. Or they're going to pay in cash. Oh, um, what? say his apartment? Uh, I say apartment, but it's more like a duplex. Um, of course, find the right one. Um, you go and you knock on the door. You know, as one does. And this one dude, like, opens the door and he's just like, Yeah? Happy's Pizza. Taste happiness. He looks down, looks at you. That's right, I did order pizza, yeah! How much do I owe you, man? Am I holding in my own, like one, two? Yeah, you're holding like, uh, you're holding two pizzas and uh, like a liter. So, uh, you say he uh, used a coupon too? Uh, I gotta get that coupon, bud. He's like, yeah, not a problem, man. Hands it to you. There you go. It's still, you know, like, is it expired or anything? Yeah, about like a day. Yeah, I won't need that guy. Alright. So, you know, I take the coupon and whatever the total is on the, the receipt. I mm -hmm. ran off that number. Alright. You tell him the number he's got to pay, and he goes, Right on, man. Yeah, no. Oh. Hold on, let me, uh... <clears throat> he looks at you. You got a change to break a hundred? Um... Buddy, uh, do I look like I got change to break a hundred? He looks at it, turns around and goes, You got change for a hundred? Nah, oh, man, just give him the whole thing! You sure? Yeah. Okay. There you go. You keep the change, man. He like pulls it back. Thanks. Um. <laughs> so. Oh. Uh, that that's just been entirely how Alex gets through life is just through ridiculous stuff like that so Look, sometimes yeah. lady luck is on alex's side all right you're not wrong there so um the total that you get after knocking off the main price and everything right and making it cheaper now you, you get 34 dollars. so in total you've made 35 today jeez i will say well, no, you made thirty five in these last two. You did a couple of uh, deliveries beforehand, so no, I want no, you no. to I'm gonna say Happy's pizza is expensive. <laughs> right, look, there's a little place called uh, Little Caesars, alright? Five dollar uh large <laughs> one top of pizza, alright? Look, it's all it, this is all custom handmade, okay? Custom handmade. Yeah, it's handmade dough, made sauce, 
I'm sure they even hand make their this cheese ain't, somehow. This ain't no handmade sauce. They get Prego <laughs> out of the cupboard. <laughs> well, that's what they that's what they sell it as anyway. It's 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 they, good. They, they 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 milk the cows fresh to make the cheese. Yes, we have a cow in the middle of the city. <laughs> it's is good, man. Uh, yes. yes, we have we have multiple cows in this city. They've called our customers. We just want that cheddar. So this takes uh, takes you a good amount of time, right? Um, okay. <clears throat> doing all this, going around, doing stuff. Uh, but you finished all your deliveries for the day. Um. All right. Uh, so yeah, you know, after I drop off the last pizza, how, m how much longer do I got on my shift? I think it's like, you said it's 2.38, and I'm sitting here looking like, I, do I work till 6 or something? Or no, I you, work you, you work probably until about... Like, I don't know when my shift started, so... Yeah, probably about 6. Give or take. But knowing you, it'll be earlier. No, it's like uh, after that I'm gonna head back to. To see if I can find my phone. So are you heading back to the the restaurant? No. <laughs> okay. So. <laughs> I find my phone. <laughs> I dropped off the pizzas. Yeah, they get their money. I'll be back in a bit. Nah, but I'm gonna make sure I stop by the the little little gas station right there. Uh, by our place, or by Kevin's place. Get him some cola. Oh, good, you replaced it. You did replace it. Good. Okay. Um, we'll say the, the... I wrote an IOU. Yeah, I wrote an IOU. Jesus. Like, I don't know what type of guy you're trying to make Alex seem like. Who knows? I don't even know. Mind you, ain't it ain't that co uh, ain't Coca Cola, you know? It's whatever the store brand is. Just getting the store brand. Go ahead and. Uh... Take off. Are you buying a two liter or are you buying cans? Ugh. I'm gonna get cans. Okay. Because um, when I get there, I'll take one can out say, mm -hmm. and write Kevin on it. And I'll <laughs> write Alex on the rest of the box. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. Um, what do you get in the cans with, with tax is about three fifty. Oh, tapes. Yeah. Alrighty. Yeah, no, I do that. Then I head back to the place to try to figure out where my phone is. Mm. Nice. Give me an investigation as you are searching. There you go. <laughs> we went back to the GDS. <laughs> because the thing you were trying to play, anyways. Oh. I mean, 
and I couldn't, and I, I can't DM and search at the same time. So, um, hold on. I knew where you were. You were here. So, um, you go back. Um, with your investigation, um, you look around everything, you know, you're like looking through the couch cushions where you may have put it down. You can't seem to find anything, but you do find a dollar fifty. Yeah. At some point I kicked my shin on the coffee table. Okay. <laughs> that, was, that rolled to acrobatics. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I'll do acrobatics. I like, a yeah. five. <clears throat> Um, it's at this point though as you're like kind of jumping around, you know, because you just kicked your shin You notice you're wearing new shoes Well They're the ones from your dream I want to sit down and like take it off like take off the shoe and try to I guess look at them Confused now. They look like shoes. They're just the ones that you dreamed about. I buy new shoes. To the white and red little cross on them. Like no, I, I'm just imagining. I'm sitting there asking, did I buy new shoes? I don't think I did. I had, I had some nice sweet Converse, but I mean, you know, I'm happy with these. <laughs> these must be Kevin's shoes. <laughs> <laughs> he won't mind. I'm just gonna put the shoe back on, and Kevin won't mind. I didn't think he had—I didn't think he had the same shoe size as me. I thought he had smaller feet, but you know. Hey. No, nope, looks like he has the. Looks like he was built to, built and equipped. Anyways, uh, no, I mean, if I can't find my phone, the only other thing I could think of is that, you know, maybe I left it at the pizza joint. If it's not here where I fell asleep. It's so the only other place. Going back to the pizza joint, huh? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Again, though, I remember. I put the case of uh, cola in the fridge, and I wrote Alex on all but one. Oh, oh I, I, I remember. Anyways, yeah, wherever the pizza joint is. All right, so uh, you get to your pizza joint. You know, um, as you're walking in, you know. One of your, uh, one of your co-workers just looks at you and is like, Hey man, he's on a rampage today. Good luck. What do you mean he's on a ramp? As you walk in, you know, you just hear, Yes, of course. <laughs> Taste happiness. Ah, oh, Alex, you're finally back. What's up, boss? Yeah, you know, I just got back from dropping off those pizzas on the other side of the town. Hmm. Must have been a lot of traffic. <laughs> oh, look. Yeah, you know, that, you know, I don't know who designed the city, but there's only like two ways to get across the river. And I'm sure, you know, swimming across that river with those pizzas ain't really going to, you know, turn out too well. Hmm. Ah. <sighs> Look, <clears throat> I got two more deliveries for you. Be quick about these ones, please. Uh, where, where are these ones at? Uh, one of them's right over, you know, right across the bridge uh, at the, the college. And the other one is on this side of town. So, look, please have your phone on you in case I need to get in contact with you. Okay. Because yeah. I don't call on your phone, but it keeps getting a busy signal. Yeah, I'm sorry. My phone's been acting up today. I don't know. 
I swear I paid the phone bill the other day, but I don't know. I don't know if the I don't know if the banks the banks uh processed it yet. Hmm. Oh look, like I said, just keep your phone on you, and I'll be happy. And the phone just starts to ring again. You just hear. Thank you for calling Happy's Pizza. Taste happiness. How can I help you? Mm hmm. Yeah, of, of, of course. La large pepperoni. I got you. And he's like pointing to the pizzas. Like, okay, go get quick before they get cold. Okay. Uh, I, I'm just like I'm going to point to like the restroom. You know, like, oh, just, just one moment. And like I uh, try and get past him. The the other guy uh, who was here. You know, the one the mm -hmm. the other worker. Just kind of go up and was like, "Yo, man, have you seen my phone?" What? No, man, I haven't seen it. I don't know where it's at. Uh, I checked the I checked my place, but I can't seem to find it. Hmm. You sure That's... I didn't leave it up here by the cash uh, crash register or something? I haven't found any phones, man. Uh, all right, look, just keep an eye out. And yeah, yeah. If, if not he a... starts complaining about not getting a hold of me, you know, just, just just say I left it somewhere, you know. Yeah, not a problem. Hey, I gotta go run a pizza. Okay. So I'm gonna go do that. You try, hopefully you find your phone. I don't know. You're <laughs> going to me about t taking these other two pizzas out though. But let, let well, let's go together. Look, yeah, man, mine's like, all oh, the way over there. Yours are over I'm here. About out the door, bud. Oh, 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 I get you. Never mind. Let's, let's go. Look, I know this is Happy's Pizza, but, you know, chill out a little bit, all right? I'm as chill as can be. I see that. Let's just go. All right, boss, I'm taking out those the, the pizza. Just it's like carrying... Up. One pizza, he's carrying two, walking out the door. He's still on the phone with a customer. Yeah, like I said, I just, you know, thumbs up, go out the door. Set up pizzas on the little moped. I like to imagine whoever this, my co-worker is, you know, it, uh, his name's, uh, uh, Jack, right? Yeah. He, he, he drives, like, you know... He's got like a Honda Civic or something. You know? <laughs> yeah. It's just like it's a it's a beater car, but it's like you know, <laughs> right? Yeah. Look, but it gets from point A to B. And that's all that matters. Yeah. Right. All right. So um, you go off. Your first uh, delivery is over here in like one of the, the tech halls. Pretty simple. The other one you had is like uh, over here. So, you so go. question: hmm. you know, I'm gonna head to the college for. My first thought is, uh, walking around to wherever this place is. I'm gonna be looking out. Trying to see if there's any, uh, I don't know. Uh, see, if, see, see if there's anything going on tonight. It's a, it's a, it's a college campus. Yeah. Right. Um. Roll me perception. I know people. We'll just call it perception because it's gonna be, you know, what you see in here, though. Haha. -ha. Nice. Okay. See, so. I don't want to um, with the stupid checks. I'm getting. You do, you do hear about a party that's uh, it's, it's in a couple of hours. You know, um, it's actually like way down over here. If you look at the map, it'll be yeah, way past them over here. All right. Um, you hear about that? You know, it's like oh man, in a couple of hours, it's you know have. You know, great time down over, down over there. I don't have a place named for it. I'm just gonna say that's where it is. So, but you do hear about that. But that's the only thing that you hear about. Um, it's over at uh, one of the, uh, one of the rich guys' houses. Yes. It's like a pool party. Yeah. Um. 
so after dealing with that, you, you know, you, you, I get, find where I got delivered pizza. Yeah, you give that pizza. Uh, you get tipped eight dollars. You heading to the next one? Yeah, you know. I mean, I feel like. So, so who's picking up the pizza? Uh. Some dude you've never seen before. He's like wearing a hoodie. He's got headphones on. You just kind of, as you bring the pizza to him, you know, he he puts all the money in your hand, including the tip, and then takes the pizza. Doesn't really say anything. Yeah, I just give him the pizza and go. Not not really. Anyways. Mm-hmm. It's like you know he he turns around and he's like you know, I do the whole slogan. Taste happiness and walk off. You go to the next one, right? This next pizza. Uh, this person uh, looks at you. Um, you knock on the door as you're holding it. As you open the door, the person looks at you and goes, Oh, it's you again. I mean, I don't know what you're talking about, but um, I've got a pizza for you. Is it the right pizza this time? I mean, it's the one I picked up from the joint. I'm sure it's correct. He kind of grabs it from you and opens it and looks at it. Closes it. Alright. I need to sign something, right? Yeah, you, you sign right here. He just signs his name and kind of like almost tosses it back to you. Thanks for the pizza. Shuts the door. I'm just going to let you all know. That hurt me physically. Being in the food service industry, I know that that's what happens sometimes. That hurt me. That hurt me. So I've felt that before. But anyways. What, what, type, what type of building is this? Um, is it a house? Is it an apartment? What? They're townhouses. Kind of like the place that I live at currently, with where all the houses are aligned together. All right. Look, I got I got something to deal with people like that. You do. Going huh? back to going go back to the moped. Going to like one of the little side satchels on the moped, right? Uh huh. Pull out a can and start shaking it. <laughs> you hear a rattle. It sounds like a marble in a can. Oh no! What are you doing? Taste happiness on the front door. <laughs> <laughs> Roll me performance. We're gonna see how well you, how good your art is. Okay, well, that's not great. You basically just went, taste happiness. That's fine. Right? Uh, roll me athletics to see if you can get away quick enough. Or athletics or stealth, you can choose. It's, it's like, it's, they're the same. Mm-hmm. Well, you easily spray that, get back on the moped, and bolt off. Exactly. You hear words echoing in your in, in your head, Alex. I'm disappointed in you. Like sit there, wondering what that was. Then the thought, of, then it's like the thought of uh, you know. Well, the thought of home hits me, and it's like, bastard. <laughs> so, uh, you, you know, trying to finish up your work, you go, you go back to work, right? Yeah. Um, as you get there, your boss is just like, all right, Alex, I have another one for you to do. You specifically, they asked for you. 
Don't ask me why or how, but it, it they was, it asked was, for you. It, it wasn't... It's not that place I just came from, right? He said something about having a wrong order. No, I mean, this one is also a wrong order, but uh, uh, I guess Jack took him the wrong pizza. All right. So I need you to take that pizza with those breadsticks and that drink to this address. All right. I'm going to, like, try to take a look at the time to figure out how much time I got left before the, par uh, before the party. Because, like, you know, he's, like, looking, he's like looking at your watch. He's like, look, run this. Call me and I'll clock you out. Um, yeah. Yeah, I'll give you a call. Look, just make the customer happy, please. Remember, taste happiness, big smile. I mean, they're always happy when they see me. It's like gonna walk out the door with pizza. As the phone rings, you see like this exhausted look on his face. You're just like, <sighs> but as you hear him pick up the phone, you just hear, thanks for calling Happy's Pizza. Taste happiness, how can I help you? Okay, so that's the end of your part of the adventure. Alrighty. Currently. Now let's go back to the beginning. To the be to the very beginning? No. Okay. Alrighty. So, Lily, Thaddeus, Olivia, and Ken. Thaddeus is currently passed out, though, but everybody else, you guys see a giant parrot and a giant spider duking it out. Um, hey, quick question. Can you guys hear me? Yeah. Yes. Oh, okay. I was only questioning that because uh, half of my cord for these headphones are literally destroyed, so I didn't know. Oh. <laughs> but yeah, I can hear you. Yes. Now, what were you saying? Oh, all right. So we're not that far away from my house. Um, <laughs> so I would like to look down this like little main street right here. Can I see my mom? Hold on. You mean a very, very angry lady? Tell me higher. Yes. Left. Higher left. Uh, hello. I'm gonna mm, go high. High? Like everyone else. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yeah. No. Um. You don't see her. Which means you know exactly what happened. She saw you run off after she yelled at you, and she's now calling police. <laughs> great, 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 awesome. Uh, another question. Mm -hmm. uh, like, going towards, like, the northeast over there, like, where there aren't buildings on the map, do I know that that's kind of, like, a clear area? Or at least more clear, you know, yes. from where we are? Yes. Okie dokie then. Um, I'm gonna do something risky. I'm not punching anybody, but <laughs> um, I guess I'm gonna stand in the middle of the street and I'm gonna yell and try to get their attention. Uh, throw rocks if I got to. So you're yelling and throwing rocks? Yes, at the two new Digimon that I see fighting. Um... You like you're throwing rocks and trying, but like with Paramon flapping its wings, the wings, uh, the the rocks aren't really hitting it. And between the two of them, like attacking each other, the loud sounds don't seem to get past these kind of like sound barriers that they're creating. Awesome. I'm gonna turn back to the group. <sighs> what are we gonna do, guys? I, I don't think our Digimon have the strength to keep fighting. You just see, uh, Labramon just kind of is just like, you know, I can, I can... You, you haven't eaten all day. Into which, I don't hear as it. she's saying that, she turns back into, uh, uh, Jezjomon. Exactly. And Thaddeus is knocked out. Into which, you know, you just pat him on, just like, Thaddeus! You gotta wake up, Daddy. You can't faint every time you see an insect Digimon. You can't do it like this. 
Uh, Gabumon's just kind of standing by Ken, like, So, uh, where did they turn back? They, they have lots of questions now. Well, um, Labramon hadn't eaten anything since she got here. I know that. So Ooh. she's probably weak. Oh, that's, that's not good. Look, I know that I can take on, like, Mega Level Digimon by myself, you know, with my punches. Pure, pure awesome strength. Uh, but there are two Digimon over there. Uh, I don't, I don't, no. Mm, uh, they don't like our odds. At that moment, um, you all hear the sound of electricity sparking, right? As you turn and look, you see uh, Parrotmon. Uh, they have done battle to the point to where now Dokugamon is basically standing in front of all of you, right? Parrotmon is down the way a little bit. Lightning is coming off of... Uh, the it's quills on its head right as you hear it go static destroyer oh god i'm grabbing my digimon and rolling <laughs> run, run. so it fires off it is going to ken picks up gobblemon and yeets him down the street as he starts running oh i'm still in the, the area <laughs> <laughs> wait you eat him which way though <laughs> Toward... <laughs> away from it <laughs> it's just like it's like yeet you got it right so as you guys are like ducking and dodging out of the way right I, the, the cone is a representation it's not going to hit you because of the, the streets I just needed the cone as a representation of how far it would go um this bolt of lightning comes and it hits to Kugamon right it just uh, you, you hear it growl out <laughs> As the lightning kind of sparks off, breaking the building, glass falling. Um, Patamon, like, curling up over top of um, TP. That way, glass doesn't get into TP. All of you guys duck and dodge out of the way. No one gets hurt from this thing. But uh, Dakugamon uh, does not seem very, very pleased. As uh, he is going to start his attack by running up the building and jumping on top of oh, Parrotmon. Crap. So these two are doing battle. Right? Uh, yep. It's at this point that all of you notice, coming from all directions, meeting them in the middle, um, black vans start driving up, right? Kind of parking, creating blockages and roads. Um, I want you all to roll me perception. Um, a question. <laughs> how how far away is is the Patamon from me? It's okay, Pat. You can re-roll it. I'll be nice. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you. I want to be around Thaddeus. Just I I'm kind of dragging him around. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay. Um. So everyone but Ken. Uh, probably because Ken's like kind of out of the way. Notices. <laughs> This symbol on the side of the uh, the vans. Right? Oh, I'm not seeing anything. Oh, you, you didn't roll high enough for it. Oh. Yeah, so you're just basically like, you're seeing the trucks, you're like, oh man, the feds. All right, so we can also see like what the uh, each letter stands for at the bottom, right? The closest one, yes, you can. Mm. All right, uh, we need to get out of here, guys. Um. So as also really quick, as you guys are doing that, right? Um. You guys hear the sound of jets kind of like firing right oh yeah we need to we need um, to get out of here it's at that point that uh you all can see coming from the other side of a building is another digimon oh. 
comes from over here. Uh, as Paratmon kind of lunges into the air, all of you just hear, Nitro Stinger! And it hits Paratmon, knocking him to the ground. Um, it's then uh, that you notice that all the vans open up, and out of them come people dressed in black, all having that emblem kind of emblazoned onto them. Uh, a gentleman with gray hair, wearing a black suit, uh, walks out and goes, All right, capture the target, please. And you can hear this clearly from the distance that you're at. Um, he said that loud, but I can't do that voice very loud. So, um, uh, You notice that they all have these, like, you know, almost bazooka-looking things. They fire them out, and nets go over the, the two Digimon. Um, the Kugumon gets zapped and relatively, like, on the ground captured. Um, but Paramon is able to kind of worm his way out and start flying away. And, uh... He goes off into the distance this giant bee trying to follow but eventually stopping and just working its way to uh Dokugamon. so you guys getting away um uh, i want to but now i'm really curious so um as all this is happening you know what go ahead and roll me stealths because we'll say you're watching from a distance. You don't want to talk to him, right? Um, or be seen by him? I don't. Okay, then you roll stealth. Anyone else going to follow or lead? I'm real tired of this. Um, I know Ken is not a stealthy dude, but sure, I'll roll stealth. Sure, with Thaddeus. Just for the heck of it. Mm. Trash can. Okay. Olivia, just roll me stealth. Okay. She's gonna try to drag Thaddeus. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, I'll say it was a group check, so you guys you guys passed. You guys are able to hide. Even with Thaddeus' unconscious, lifeless body. <laughs> uh, in fact, no. As you're trying to hide, Thaddeus wakes up, sees the giant metallic bee, and goes, huh. <laughs> Um... As you, guys are, as you guys are looking, um, you guys do see this gentleman. Um, is the one kind of uh, giving orders to these men, right? Um, he'd be about here. So, wherever you guys are kind of... You're much closer. These buildings are... You're much... Cl My point is you're close, right? We're using this as not general for distance. It's just kind of where you sit. You know what I mean. Anyways, so this gentleman um, is kind of standing here giving orders to everybody. And uh, <clears throat> at one point you hear uh, one of the guards, I guess we'll call them, soldiers, men in black, uh, walks up to him and goes, General Steele, we seem to have captured Dokugamon. With the help of Cannon Beamon, we were able to precisely strike him. However, Paramon got away. Mm. That does not bode well. Generally, Paramon's are very calm. This one seemed very agitated. Anyways, please transfer Dokugamon back to the base. Or we'll send him back to the digital world. Then. Yes, sir, of course. What? Hmm. What? What? Are you just saying what to yourself? <laughs> trying to get Ken's attention. Uh, no, I'm, <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm just. I'm, it's to myself. It's whispered. So, Ken, you just hear. Lily just going over there going, what, what, what? Um, eventually, um, you, know, you, you all kind of notice that General still like, turns around to look in your direction, so you guys kind of pop away, right? You know? Go back to your hiding spots. All right. Load him up. Leave. We'll say it was a gas leak. He gets in a truck, and all the disc trucks leave. 
driving off in different directions, so you're not sure where they're actually headed. Um, Lily's freaking out. <laughs> um, she's gonna grab Ken and groom on. She's gonna run across the street to join the rest of the, the people. Okay, um, guys, yeah, um, I'm not 100% sure. Not 100% sure. But, um, that dude had the same last name as Alex. So, you know, I don't, I don't know anybody that, you know, is related to him, but, um, yeah. And then, and then, so, so, so do they have something that can get us to the digital world? Like, are we going to have to, like, find their base and, like, I don't want to say raid, but, like, definitely, you know, you sneak say, in there. Look, I'm saying that we raid them. <laughs> I don't know about that. Not uh, right now, As anyway. you guys are, just like, you know, kind of, and Gabmon says that, Kudamon is just like, well, look, with our current strength, I don't believe we would be raiding anybody. Huh. Especially with a tamer down. Oh, you know, he'll be fine in a minute. Just, um, got some smelling salts or something. Like, just, that's what I should have picked up from the store. Ah, uh, yes. Now nah, I got a better one. Please don't punch him. <laughs> no. Nah. No, 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 no. Nah, something that's gonna wake him up. I, is it gonna hurt him? No. Alright, got him on. I'm gonna lift his shirt. What? I need you to tickle him. Okay, I mean, it's, he has these claws, though. Like, I don't know if that's safe. Too right. There's only one way I know how to tickle. With excessive force! Blue blah! As you do that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> As he does that, Kudamon just wraps his tail around his mouth. Why? Oh, I'm, I'm just going to try and um, shake Thaddeus. Like, hey, hey, hey. And I'll get more aggressive, like, to where I'm physically grabbing clothes and shaking and, you know, um, yeah. Be careful, though. He was bleeding out, like, five minutes ago. Oh, he's fine. He's fine. He got puppy dog kisses. He's fine. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm going to let you guys do some stuff for a second. Maybe role play a little bit. Come up with a plan. I, on the other end, have to go get dinner. We'll be right back. Okay. Like, you know, you explain, you, you tell Olivia that, you know, oh. you got, you got pu <laughs> puppy dog kisses, but I don't think, you know, Oh, um, him. Uh, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Dog secures everything. Um, <laughs> he has bandages they, well, on him. Wait, do they? See, now I don't know because in the digital world, puppy dog kisses are great. <laughs> in the real world, maybe not so much. Oh, um, we we need to get back. Um, I don't know how we're going to get him across town right now. Please I mean, stop. Ken, yeah, Ken has some muscles. Please let Ken carry him. I am not very good at carrying him. Yeah, let me carry him. I can carry him like yeah. uh, King Kong holding some woman you <laughs> talk to. Um, should we go back to, to his place, I guess? Uh, we definitely... And we need to kind of go around. My house is right over there, and I already ran for my mom. Actually, I'm going to take Thad's back to his place so uh, okay. we can get that pizza. What about the pizza guy? Yeah. So think... if you'll excuse me, I'm going to take him and I'm going to uh, start making my way downtown. Walking fast, faces passing, I'm homebound. Home -na 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 -na. I'm going to. Yeah, I'm going to go as long as we go around. And I realize... Because I marked my house. <laughs> Thaddeus' house is not marked. Oh, I and I don't remember is. which house it is. <laughs> Actually, yeah, I don't remember where it is either. We'll wait. So there's only one way to wake him up. Um, <laughs> so, so, yeah. Um, hopefully, maybe by chance, uh, the pizza hasn't been re-delivered and we haven't missed Alex yet. They did say it was going to take longer than normal to deliver that pizza, so I think we have enough yeah, time. Let's hope so. <laughs> I think his house is somewhere around here-ish. 
I know it's in bridge. Ski District. <laughs> I think it is somewhere around there. Like, I just can't... It's... Yeah, somewhere around here. We didn't mark go, it. I could go look at the bridge. Alright, so screen. what I'm gonna do, right? I'm gonna just start walking. And I'm going to drag him. I mean, maybe not drag him? <laughs> no, okay, I'm gonna put him under my arm, right? I and can maybe... hold his legs if you want. Like... No, no, no. I, it's cool. I'm gonna carry him by his rib cage. Maybe him being jostled by me will wake him. Now, what you do is you find a trash can. You know, one of the ones that has like two wheels. Just put him in that and you just drag him. Well, he that have seems... cuts. That Can would we just make it infected. Can we just call a cab? <laughs> uh, how much does that cost? I, don't know. I have no money. I still have money. I mean, I have, like I have ten bucks. <laughs> Some money, yeah. No, we're just gonna have to. We're gonna have to hoof it. I mean, I just imagine y'all are walking down the street, and you know, you start talking about a cab or walking, and Gobblemon is just like, you know, why not take that car? Oh wait, no, the house <laughs> is marked still. Oh, well, I just put that over yeah. there. Oh, uh. it's like I, I think it's somewhere in this general area. I remember so? it being. But, uh, yeah, no, we can't just take cars. <laughs> no, that's the easy way out. All right. I'm back with my food. Hey. Where the house is. <laughs> yeah, All right, guys, so what we're going to do, right, if we see those guys again, it's right you're going to let me do all the talking while you sneak into the back of one of the vans. It's that house but, right there. Wouldn't, that house? They, wouldn't they notice us, though? It's and an then it makes me question... Like how long have Digimon been coming to the world and we hadn't noticed? All right, since the house is marked, Ken will use his secret technique. Mm -hmm. Known as... Poof. Oh, everybody wow. left Lily. <laughs> oh, wait, no, I moved to Olivia. <laughs> That's okay, I'll move to <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so Can we're back please? in his house. <laughs> yep, you're back there. Um, are there any pizzas left outside? <laughs> That's the thing, is like, yeah, it's like, would I have gotten there before there? Hmm. Roll me. No, no, hold on. Higher low. Should I roll for athletics? No, I got this. High or low? I mean, I'm gonna go high like the little Pac-Man on my pizza box. No. They get there before you do. No. So, at some point, they just run past me. Yeah, you got a Cause... bike coming on. Cause... Wait, what? Mm -hmm. I'm just saying they didn't notice you. We had an unconscious body, you know, that takes a lot of priority. Uh, unconscious body? I'm on a moped. Ken is very strong. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Ken's like, for every person I beat up, I do one push up. <laughs> and he's beat up a lot of dudes. <laughs> so a lot of push ups. <laughs> I'm just imagining, you know. Him after Bearmon, he's just like, wait, I know, he's like, I know Bearmon is technically one Digimon, but I hit him a lot. He should count as five. Yeah, every, <laughs> every punch counts. Every punch counts. Every punch I do on a person, I do a push-up. What? <laughs> um, so, I guess, uh, I'm going to, um... I guess I'm gonna wait and see if this pizza man comes. And I guess we'll sit Thaddeus down on the couch or something and hope he wakes up soon. Thaddeus laying on the couch, getting smacked by Patamon the whole time. <laughs> He's like, Come on, TP, you gotta wake up. Why didn't I tell you about all the times with the insect? You can't keep doing this. You gotta think those slaps hurt, because, you know, that's swole Patamon. 
Yeah. He got, he got this. No, he got this. He got this. It's not working. It'll work. Don't worry. <laughs> just gotta slap him enough. He eventually, you just notice see that he gets kind of tired and little. <sighs> Uh, and he kind of like rolls back. As he rolls back, he digivolves into Tokomon. Yeah. All right, Gabumon, start slapping. Okay, little well, buddy, I'll get you a snack. Maybe he shouldn't. You uh, just hear Gabumon like cracking his knuckles. I've been waiting for this all day. <laughs> no. He goes to pouring his hand up, and he's like, "Yeah!" Then you just see a Sunomon with a horn. Where Gabumon used to be, he's like, "Where did my arms go?" Okay, Ken? yeah, yeah, we're gonna have to do something. Ken, I require more taquitos, please. Or else, how else am I going to awaken the Thaddeus? Uh, just, just let him rest. Or he's, he's, you know, traumatic experience, two bugs in one day. He had a hard day. Um, the, on Thaddeus's door, like, does it have a, like, a peephole? It does. I'm just staring at that peephole. Just, just, that's what I'm doing with my life right now. Alrighty. So, Alex. Yo. You now come to the place where they are. Okay. Yeah. I go up, I find the, the door, I knock on the door. Lily, you see that it is Alex. Alrighty, so I want to do a, a, a move like um, I yank the door open, grab him by the front of his shirt, yank him in, and then shut and lock the door. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Get over Hold here! <laughs> Oh, okay. Roll. Uh, hold on, Alex. Are you going to resist this? Or are you going to be like, Hey, head ah! I mean... You know what? I... Lily, go ahead and roll me um, athletics. If it's low, then you and Alex will have to do a... Basically a grapple. To see if you can pull him in. Okay, well... You think you're fat? You're trying to be fast, but as you go to grab him, he kind of notices just, just barely. So now roll me. Again, Lily, roll me athletics, and then um, Alex, roll me acrobatics. Or athletics, whichever one you want to do. Oh man. So you go to like pull him, and he's just like, "Whoa, lady!" He's like, let, he like kind of pushes off, and is like holding the pizza, and he's just like. I get you with the pizza. Like, just like, I'm just imagining he's like holding the pizza. Like, going through Alex's brain is like, I know you want the pizza, but jeez. Wait, he didn't say that out loud? I don't know what he said out loud. What'd you say out loud? What the hell, lady? Don't lady me. Get your ass in this house. I mean, but. Oh, <laughs> Whoa, language people, Gabumon is present. <laughs> um. Alex, this is not funny, okay? There is some serious mess going on. You need to get in the house. We have been, I have been trying to find you all day. Lady, I, I don't know who you are. Hey, look, I just got told I got a pizza here. Um, and As you're I, sitting uh, there, you just hear... No, it's Alex. As you see a tiny little thing with a, a tiny little orange ball of fluff with a horn. Just look up at you. Hello, it's me, Sunoman. As I see this, they're just going to be like, Oh, God. Throw the pizza at him. Would you like a bite? <gasps> what are you doing? <gasps> he gets covered in the pizza box. It no, he kind of rolls, rolls over it. He just goes, you see him open it with the horn? <gasps> it is more deliciousness. Thank you, you Alex, that. for bringing no, me what I want. It. You share that with everybody else. Um, that was Garurumon. Ken. Ken. Uh, look, I, I 
don't know what's going on here. Look, you guys have the pizza. You can, you guys got it. All right. Uh, I'm going to go now. Oh, no, you're not. Kent! Yes? He's trying to escape. You got to stop him. Ken appears from the corner and just grabs him. <laughs> <laughs> like, look, buddy. Look, okay. all right? No, it is going to be another contested check. So athletics and acrobatics. Um, so athletics don't from Ken. Me, Alex. And then um, athletics or acrobatics from you, Alex. Like, like look, buddy, look. I, look. I ain't got no beef with you. Oh, jeez. Damn. <laughs> so you're just like, look, I got no beef. And then you just see Ken's arm just like. <sighs> and then you just hear, you know, Scorpion, like, it's playing on the TV or something. You just hear, get over here. Look, buddy, let me go. All right? That's all I can do. I'm like slapping your arm. Hey, I can't, it's like, I can't breathe. Let me go. It's, here, Ken is here. Look, man, I had to pay extra to have you come over here. Look, I, I don't know what's going on. All right? I can't, I can't breathe. You just... You... Um, so... You just, uh, uh, Zha -Zha -Ma just kind of like walks, walks, you know, the little puff ball of tiny little dog, dogness just kind of looks up at Alex. So does that mean that you've forgotten why you little mourn? What? Why is the dog talking? All right, let's, let's get him in the house. Get him in the house. <laughs> just get him in and I guess you shut the door. Yes, and I'm standing in front of it. It's like, why doesn't he remember? Like, did he hit his head or something? Hmm. Is it because he doesn't have his digi thingies? Like, his, his redial or decoder? Maybe it's because... He left the digital world in a different way than we did. You, you don't remember absolutely anything about being in the digital world with Digimon, Alex? Alex? Hello? Uh, Alex? choked out no he didn't oh my he did not God. pass out with a 17 you are still with a three i did that oh, earlier okay I've been waiting all y'all been talking back and forth okay well uh alex now Mind you, gets just knocked just out like, as it, ken it, is it's holding, him. holding me oh oh let him go let him go let him go <laughs> yeah all right weakling <laughs> As you set Alex down, Shunmon's like, "Don't worry, I'll wake him up." No, 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 no. Let's just, let's just. Oh my God, this is horrible. This is not how uh, I imagined this was gonna go. Okay, what's going on? Hello, Alex. Excuse me, Shunmon. Let me tell you of the situation. Currently, you are in Darius' house, who is asleep. And I have eaten most of the pizza. <laughs> However, <laughs> we need you to remember so that we can save the digital world. And Ryuraman, who I'm guessing is not with you. Also, would you like to fight? Oh, you... Hey, hey, sorry. Look, I'm sorry we choked you out, okay? Just... Look, you want. All right, look, you, you can have my tip money, all right? No, we don't want your tip money! I do. <laughs> <laughs> look, 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 okay? We we had something happen to us, okay? Uh, we, we went to this place, and we were there for, like, days. You know, I thought we formed a bond, a friendship at least. You know, um, and you know, you had Ryudamon, he was your, your digi partner, like, we have digi partners, and, 
and um, we got sucked out of the digital world, but we can't find two of our friends, so we think that they're still there, and we need you to remember. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hastily take out his phone and and and, and, and try to try to log into this. Like, try to open it. I can't open it because I don't have the password. I mean, what is that? It's your phone. My phone. It's your phone. Trust me. Just, just try. Just try to, to get into it, please. Like just, uh, I'm like kind of just scanning the room. Uh-uh, weird, uh-uh. Weird Eyes on me. Into which... Eyes on me. T Tokomon kind of crawls out, right? Having looked like he just ate some, a slice of pizza. Looks over at... <clears throat> looks over at Alex because he hadn't n really noticed that Alex was there. You know, after falling, de digivolving He finally sees Alex. Tokomon with its big, nasty grin is just like... Alex, it's you. Oh God, demon hamster. Okay, that's that's <laughs> not how. Let, let's tone the smile down a little bit. But I'm happy to see him. Now you also have giant teeth, rows of them, <laughs> like a shark. I'm trying to be awfully nice, and every once in a while, oh look at that, Daddy is can awaken now. You don't remember us at all. Look, I hold on, oh, hold on, hold on. So, so if that finally woke up, yes. Where is Pokemon at the moment? He's over on the. Uh, he, he's on the floor, closer to crawled Alex than you. A, crawled out of a pizza box. Is he facing away from me? Yes. Okay. I was gonna say, that he has to wake up to a damn heart attack. <laughs> <laughs> well, you already woke up once to a cannon beam on. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, so, um, so Thaddeus wakes up and is like, oh, uh, oh, uh, and like, like he's, he's feeling around, like, where he got hit and which was like applied pressure on when he was carried like oh god and he looks over and sees alex is like alex you're here this is his house uh, oh, this ain't my first rodeo you are not helping ken it's literally his house is there any pizza I don't uh, think so. Yeah. I think, <laughs> Into which you just you just hear a few you, just, you just hear uh, <laughs> go. Definitely not. Uh, no. Gabumon's like, uh, no, or not Gabumon. Sunamon like bro like pushes a box towards Thaddeus. I left these very strange and not delicious smelling things for you. He opens up and sees bread, uh, the, the, the bread crust, doesn't no. he? No, the bread sticks. Oh, the bread sticks? Yeah. Oh, that is, is a bit. Good. I thought that's, it was just going to be a whole bunch of olives for the first pizza. Thanks, buddy. And Thad's that, that is, is going to just take Look, a, a, just... a bread stick and start Hold nibbling on, on it. I keep doing the wrong voice. <clears throat> Yuka, these, these things smell very strange, and I would really rather not, not tempt them. Everything else I've had here smells quite delicious, except for that other one that had vegetables. Oh, there's a veggie pizza? <laughs> Sunamon goes up and kind of, like, smacks you a little bit with the horn. It doesn't pierce or, like, stab into you, but it, like, smacks you. He's just like, we never talk about the veggie pizza. Just, just where is it? He points to to an empty box. Yeah. Where where did it go? Whoa! What? What just happened? Despite popular belief, I really like veggies. <laughs> oh. Well, I've I've got a. Uh, uh, vegan pizza in the the freezer 
You want to split that with me? Oh no, but I still like cheese. Uh, it's their own. Lactose intolerant. What? what? I mean, you're laying on the ground, so I can just put it in the oven for you, man. Thank you. <laughs> well, they're the sitting oven here. Four fifty. <laughs> well, they're sitting here discussing pizza. <laughs> Lily still looks panicked. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's just really funny. It's just like, do you remember, Alex? Do you remember? Hey, pizza, what? Yeah, dude, dude. He's like, he's like holding like Alex by like the scruff. He's like shaking him, and then he just stops. Ken's just like, um, I'll make the pizza for you, man. He's like, dr just drops Alex. Yeah, don't worry, I got it. Four fifty. Yeah, and they're like chatting, and it's just like Alex is like sitting there like. This is the craziest group of kidnappers I've ever seen. <laughs> <sighs> look, look, Alex, I'm sorry, okay? It's just been a really rough day. I had a lot of information, and I just need you to remember what happened. I'm so worried about everybody who we think got left in the digital world, and I don't know what happened to Rayudamon, and, and, and there's Jessica and JJ, and what I'm thinking about, okay? Please. Please. We need to cry. What, what, Lily, what's, what's the matter? He you doesn't have... remember! You, do you not remember us, Alex? Look, I just came and grabbed all the pizza. So you don't remember being in the digital world and having a partner, Digimon, Ryudamon, who kind of seems like he was always disappointed in you, and 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 Jessica with uh, good good times with with Jessica. That was not friends. the time, Thaddeus. Ken just pokes his head out from around the corner like, uh huh, yeah, that's what we're gonna go with. <laughs> oh. I know. Do you remember Wormon? Look, look. You talking about that that video game thing? Yes, 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 yes. That's what it is. It's a real place. It exists. It's a real place. And and the animals there, they're Digimon and they're alive and they have feelings and they have thoughts and they're real. And we were there. You just see. I just got to go there and wreck stuff. Sunamon's just kind of like sitting next to you, Alex, and he's just like, "You should remember. Most of us remember you." I'm gonna poke him. You guys. Is that confirmation that we want to fight? What are you? I told you, I'm Sunamon. I become Gabumon when I did evolve, and then I become Gururumon. I really like when I'm Garuruman. Okay. So, if, if this is all real, I'm not saying it's not. Or it is. Whatever. If we're home, why do we need to go back? We can't find JJ or Jessica. And time, time is different there. We thought we were gone for days and days, and we were only gone for minutes. I mean, like... If they're still stuck there, God knows how much time has passed for them. What if they're not? Oh, oh God, how long was I out? Uh, I don't know, man, like 20 minutes. You miss the feds. But the fed, but time. Uh, okay, oh god, okay, let's get back to that later. How long was? Oh god. All right, all right, all right. Fine, 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 fine. If you don't remember us, then I, I can't make you. But could I talk to you about something personal? Personaler than. Um... Ooh, ooh, let's tie him up. No, don't... What? No! No! Um, I don't 
know how I feel about that. Uh, we saw somebody today. Um, and they had the last name Steel. Uh, kind of maybe yay tall, gray haired, kind of a deep, low voice. Very regal sounding. Do you know him? Uh, I don't know. Um, tall man, gray hair. Yes, they called him General. Yeah. I don't know what that means. That's a really weird first name. So, was this guy asking you questions? Mm, no. Um, there were two very large Digimon fighting, and all these trucks pulled up, and it seemed like he was in charge of them. And um, he took one of them away, and he also they also had another Digimon that seemed like it was fighting for them somehow, and. You know, when I heard his last name, and I know that's your last name, I thought maybe you guys would be related, and maybe tell us, maybe possibly where he would be located. But since you don't know who he is, I guess it doesn't matter. Look, if you... I know you want to leave. So, seriously, this is your phone. Just take it. And I'm... We can't keep you here. Just please don't tell the cops. Probably, should probably give his uh, his watch back as well. Uh, yeah, decoder. Ken Ken has that. Uh, if if he claims uh, he doesn't know us, then how can we have it stuck? Yeah, well, I, I've never seen a Rolex. No, <laughs> no. I mean, to be fair, the our phones don't look like how they originally did so I can understand why it's confusing and we don't technically have proof that we know you other than you know knowing your name is Alex Steele and you're kind of a douche I mean what <clears throat> here's your phone <laughs> oh, well. it's gonna go cry in the other room uh. so yes I will hand him his phone and I will go and leave and you know, he can hear me sniffling very hard. Oh. Hey, Alex, I, I just... I mean, you you kind of left us in the digital world. You weren't feeling... Uh, you weren't really feeling like you got along so well with the rest of us or... Look, that whole situation in general, look, but I, I do want you to I know fine. Thing, things like I don't understand what's going on. You know, this, this sounds a bit weird. Just dude. if you see that guy again, don't don't talk to him. Okay. Um. Oh, you, uh, you, you were, were you already paid for the, the pizza? I mean, I guess this is supposed to be, like, some sort oh. of fix. Oh, did, did you, did, did you guys order with, like, card, or was it, like, cash? It was cash the first time. Yeah, this was a free one. Oh, uh, okay. Um, uh, Sean, how many, how many, how much money does Thaddeus have left at the moment? Uh, Thaddeus, left to him currently, has. Let me open it up. Twenty six dollars. Yeah, Th Thad's is gonna. He's gonna go ahead and hand that to Alex, be like, here, for, 
for the pizza and for all the extra craziness. Um, Boy, what you doing? I already paid for the pizza. Well, you, you, you yes, but he needs a tip, and no, you... no, look, you, you, you keep that. Like, look, it just, it just never happened. All right. I won't, I won't call the police, and y'all let me go. Call it square. Did he just say he's gonna call the police? He said he Yo, won't big call guy, the big police. Guy. Calm down, alright? <laughs> I can only imagine Olivia sitting there now going, I may have followed the wrong people. Uh huh. <laughs> the whole time, though, you've got Kudamon like, This is intense! I love it! Raidamon's like a person who went to a rave for the first time and found out that they actually dig it. <laughs> Alrighty. Anyways. So yeah, Alex, you've decided that you're uh, you're leaving? Uh, right now I'm going down I'm gonna head out the door and go back to my little moped. Alright. And never come back. Quickly, re-roll me a character. No, <laughs> <laughs> That was your final option. Alex is dead forever. <laughs> Poor Ryudamon. But no. All right, Poor Alex. Poor Ryudamon. You, uh, you go out. You leave, uh, you leave them. So, now it's just them. So what are we going to do? Well, I'm waiting for this pizza to finish. Dads, roll me percep. You know what? All of you roll me perception. Oh, okay. Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll let you determine whether I notice anything or not. Oh, that's right. You're not on your computer yet. Yeah, I'm. <laughs> oh, buddy. I am still waiting on transport. Wait, I am how, really tired wait, of these rolls. You're still waiting on transport? Yeah. What do you mean you're still waiting on transport? It takes 10 minutes to get there. Well, apparently Panda asked her to pick up, like, pet food stuff. and But even then, I'm not certain as to why I haven't seen her. So I, like, in the past, like, five-ish minutes, I went up target side and didn't see her. I am checking parking garage and the only other route is I'm going to see if I can see the other game stop from here to see if she accidentally went to the wrong one. Fun. All right. Barring that, I will return to my game stop. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, Thaddeus, you're the only one that notices. Ha <laughs> your, ha! Uh, your phone. Ye. Seems that the update's really close to finishing. In fact, the update finishes. Oh, oh, good. Uh, guys, guys, the, the 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 phones, the phone. Um, I don't even know if I got around to telling you. Uh, the 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 they're doing an update sort of thing, so I I think we'll be able to get back as soon as this thing is sorted. And uh, it, it looks like it's done, so uh, let's let's see what we can do from here. So that is going to start uh, working. Kitty, she couldn't find you. So I will be there to pick you up in a minute. We're going to take an intermission. Oh, uh, she she just got back. Yeah, and she just threw the keys away. So, anyways, I will be there to pick you up. We're going to go on an intermission. You all talk. It should only be a half hour maximum. I'm sorry. Already. Um. Here, I'll put it on the. Be right back. Screen. So I'll be back. I will yeah, adjust the music. It's time to make memes. 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 Ah. <sighs>
so yeah, stressing out to the max. There we go. There's a lovely intermission music. Yeah, if if she if she didn't see me there, then and yeah, because I, I imagine she would have waited at least a little bit. Then even if she had come by while I was wandering around, like I, I would have seen her. So I I presume she went to the wrong one, because there's two that are like within reasonable walking distance of each other, so... That sucks for me. Yeah. Also, my hands are getting a little cold. Yeah, it is cold out there today. And even once I get back, I will still need to update my fantasy grounds oh, because... No. Yeah, I, I didn't have my laptop out this whole time because I'm outside and well, see, luckily, yeah, don't trust people. Luckily, what uh, you know, Sean said, all this is just gonna be, you know, RP session, no fighting. Yeah, I, it also made me really glad since I had another freaking closing shift tonight. That um, one that that Alex had all of his RP stuff that he had to do for you know. Meanwhile, and then. Thaddeus ended last session, passed out, so it gave, it gave, it gave me a reasonable excuse of why I wasn't able to do things just yet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, since it is all RP, it is, yeah, it could just pop in the chat. I'm real glad that nothing crazy has gone down tonight with all the election stuff that was a that was a concern about whether i'd potentially have to to close up a little early because people being stupid but there was there was no such concern now whether anything crazy happens tomorrow when i open that remains to be seen So, fine. The guy was just over here talking to herself in chat. Oh. I look at her messages. Man, I actually can't wait for uh, when we raid the feds. Because <laughs> I definitely have a song pulled up. For... <laughs> Let me rephrase this. There's a song that I sent to Alex that'll probably get pulled up at some point for that. Because there are shenanigans that are going to happen. No, I just realized. Mm hmm. My food has probably gotten cold. Yeah, probably. It's like pizza. Mm hmm. It's so sad. Oh. Yes. Thaddeus I... has his breadsticks, and I have the snacks that I brought with me to work. Yes, Iris, I support you. Let me pull up that so I can see what's going on in the chat. Yeah, she's Iris. Even though she could come join us. And say yeah. Uh, if she wants to, to pop into the Discord and converse while we're in intermission. All right, so I say before he leaves, we just go back out there and kidnap him again, and what? Like this never happened. <laughs> we'll start over. Mm. Why? 
No, if if he if he really doesn't remember, then ki yeah, kidnapping him won't even really do any particular good. Do you think there's a way to jog his memory? Kidnap him again. <laughs> Punch him. <laughs> Pistol whip him. <laughs> I don't know. Electroshock to trigger the impulses and, and reconnect the synapses in his brain. So we need a taser. Yeah. And you wonder why Alex doesn't want to remember. <laughs> <laughs> I got to do him is shoot him in the back of the head with a force ballista. That'll jog his memory. I'm, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be totally honest. Uh, if if uh, if the particular roleplay had gone a little differently. Thaddeus was gonna actually go. I, as as a player, I was planning on having Thaddeus go into his closet, grab a Nerf gun, and shoot Jeez. Alex in the back. <laughs> Man, I really wish you had done that. <laughs> Next time, you can, do it you can have him again. I mean, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm already out the door. We know yeah. where we work. <laughs> no, it's like you're gonna show up at work and we're there already. Now you're squatting no, out, whatever. You, you, I'm gonna you, wonder you've how, gone how, out the how door. you get there before me on my moped. You got out the door and you're trying to like start your moped, which is giving you troubles. And then that's why we passed you, is because like you, your, your, mo your moped like was having trouble. And, and you just, all you hear as you're trying to start the thing. Yo, these memes have been extra spicy today. <laughs> I'm working. It's all coming. I'm working hard. <laughs> Man, I miss playing. This is getting good. Hey. Hopefully soon. Yes, Hopefully soon. <laughs> Hopefully soon. Dude, I'm trying. I'm trying. I want to get back. I want to get back yesterday. Maybe you can play an NPC. Oh, oh, maybe. I can play uh, Mr. Commander Steel over there. <laughs> you can maybe you can play Ken's enemies. conscious. Did you really have to fight? <laughs> oh. I kind of think that's non-existent. You don't, you don't miss it. <laughs> Ken is Ken's conscious. Up in your head, you got on headphones, and you're conscious about there being like, um, hey, I don't think we should be doing that, and you're just bobbing along, you don't even hear it. His whole personality at this point is, my main goal is to blow up neck like, I don't know, nobody. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah. Yeah, just so we're clear, I made sure to hand you that phone in your hands, Alex. And I watched you as you left to make sure you didn't set it down in the house. I don't know what happened after you got out of the house. Threw it in the nearest trash bin on his way out. It's like, you, you don't get nothing, okay? You already, you, already, you already used all your bits, whatever. I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm so bad. <laughs> you, 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 what do you call it when you sell? You sold. You sold it. Uh, yes, that. So mad. Look, look, look. You can with pawn shop. You can always go back and buy it back. Not this pawn shop. Not that one. That dude's dead. We saw to it. Yep, he's dead for sure. <laughs> I know I'm gonna make more of these memes after the like at some point tonight. Yeah. Is it work? Look, I just imagine trying to sit here, trying to go sleep. All of a sudden, the phone is just gonna keep going off. God damn it, Brennan! <laughs> you guys should have put your numbers into his phone. I couldn't get into his phone. Oh. Cause it had a password up there, and I couldn't get into it. And I wasn't even gonna try and guess, cause. I think I think I asked if there was like marks or like you know handprints or something, but but yeah, no, because I I had thought about going into his phone to see what I could find. Give me your phone. 
fingerprint ID. Ugh. See, maybe, know. maybe if you would have been here, you would have been able to get into his phone. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> maybe. Jessica, where are you at? Good question. Hmm. I mean, no one's checked the Graham residence, but I can tell you, maybe, maybe, I don't know. You, you, you see, you see. We we I already lost that opportunity. Like, how, how come you know y'all y'all are thinking that these people are back in this weird world? Well, you know they here in this world. I think they're like a little bit more responsible to have their digivices, so we would know where they are. <laughs> you heard me. And also, I think we lost our opportunity to go to to go to the Graham residence now. At least Thaddeus can't go there. Yeah, Thaddeus permanently banned. Although I'm about, to, about to ruin Ken's whole career with this next move. Absolutely. No thoughts. Head empty. Fists only. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, to be fair, uh, we don't know where the other two live, and, um... I mean, we know where someone's father works, and, you know... Yeah, and we... successfully we, track down him. Yeah, and we... We lost that chance now. <laughs> Just saying, getting into the Graham residence is hard. Yes. You have to get past the vicious, vicious chihuahua. Yes. Well, no. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I was, about to, I was about to say some a chihuahua man is pretty ferocious and dangerous. It's like on, on the, on the, you have like a, a fence and it's just a beware of dog. <laughs> beware of dog. Go inside. It's it's just... Tiny Pomeranian. Yeah. No, it's a tiny Yorkie. You know Yorkies? They're the scariest little things. I think our Yorkies are scarier than Chihuahuas. I've never had a dog, so I don't know no difference. <laughs> what are you talking about? You have, you have the Labramon. Oh yeah. my god. <laughs> <laughs> totally different. Uh, Alice has not had a dog. <laughs> Yeah, mm. that's like a dog. No, she's like a horse, um, horse type. Dog thing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> horse. Horse, donkey, whatever, yeah. And she runs to the house at night. She sounds like a, a horse galloping. And she's honestly <laughs> quite small. <laughs> yeah, she is. Compared to the two cats, she's the small one. She makes the most noise. She's also the older <laughs> one. If you say her name fast enough, it sounds like you're saying donkey. Her name's Don Kitty. Donkey. Don Kitty. Donkey. The Don. The big boss. Well, yeah, she she tries to run this place. <laughs> <laughs> I just imagine you have all these big thoughts, uh, Brennan about getting into this base and you just gonna get stopped at the front gate. Nah, son. <laughs> nah, he's gonna be like, I'm gonna bust up in there and as soon as he turns to like, just walk up in there, uh, rifle butt to the face. <laughs> you guys are actually gonna storm the military base. Oh my god. Uh, if, gotta... if it, we're gonna have to. Like, if that's what we gotta do, that's what we gotta do. Then <laughs> Twelve soldiers standing right around you. Yeah. I mean, Cat's got a firearm. Shh, the audience isn't supposed to know that yet. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, Wait, was that? Oh, oh, whoops. That, that was a surprise. Ah! Sorry. <laughs> and we move on like it was never said, and we talk about something completely different. Like storming the base. <laughs> We're storming the military base. I don't know how, like, it's like, my question is, do we even know about it? <laughs> is there, like, a weird structure that we would be like, oh, yeah, that is clearly where it is. No, this thing's there, probably there, underground. There's no, there's a military base here. <laughs> oh, well, that makes it so much easier. Someone's <laughs> father or <laughs> relative works there. Hmm. Apparently not. Hmm. <laughs> Somebody, <laughs> Ken, might be arrested on sight going there. 
We're gonna have to get disguises. Since you guys might Three not know this, in a trench coat. Let's but, go. Um, We're gonna have a whole like Law and Order episode. Ken may or may not be a wanted man. You know, may or may not be. I could kind of believe it slightly. Or maybe just is. Ah. Maybe Fair just enough. is. The problem is they haven't been able to track him down just because uh, they, they don't know his last name. They just know him by Ken. Mm. Oh, that's right. Even your name up there just says Ken. Everybody else has their last name. Mm -hmm. Such a mysterious man. Who knows? Maybe Ken isn't even his real name. Maybe you just picked it because it sounds cool. Yeah, it's just easy to remember. Yeah. <laughs> 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 sounds tough. Damn. The real question is, if I said my last name is Masters, would everybody believe me? Masters? I don't know. Then again, Steel, so... What, what, what about Steel? <laughs> so I'm guessing nobody got That's that joke? That's weird, dude. No, dude, I was sitting over here trying. <laughs> oh, Kent Masters? Uh, Ken from Street Fighter? Ken from Street Fighter has a last name? Yeah. What? I never heard it. I'm, I'm sorry, bro, but you like the only real, like, you know, fighting games uh, guru up in here? Oh, yeah. No. Oh. It's, it's yes, like some of yes. us may have dabbled, but that's about it. <laughs> oh. We, you ain't got no, you, you don't got no tournament competition up in here. No. Dang. We, we a bunch of button mashers. <laughs> I was about to say. You find that combo that works and you stick with it. Spam. Yes. That X button. <laughs> so you guys are all Abigail players. See, jokes like that, again, none of us are gonna get. Mm -mm. Abigail's this really right big head. dude that makes the screen actually zoom out because of how big he is. Oh. oh. And his forward walk has super armor, so you have to hit him multiple times to stop him from walking towards you. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds pretty baller. Just, just walk towards them. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's like I, I've. I've watched some, uh, uh, you know, videos of guys playing, you know, like one recently is just people playing like, um, Dragon Ball Fighters. But again, my, 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 my reflexes and whatnot are not well enough to do any games like that. Like. I'm trying to get back into Dragon Ball Fighters, and who drew a T on the map? That was me, uh, so I can remember where Thaddeus' house is. Oh, okay. But, uh, nah, I mean, I'm trying to get back into Dragon Ball Fighters. Like, I think the last time I played it was when the first two DLC characters, Bardock and Broly, came out. Yeah. And it's been some years. I think it's like there's a there's like three guys uh, that are like they do uh, I've watched a few of their videos where it's like they're always trying to do these like uh, I guess raids you know like I guess Dragon Ball uh, the, the fighters has a has like a raid mode or something where you choose is a it the uh, the lobby madness dudes I don't think so because their videos are always like three idiots. Like three idiots versus, you know. Honestly, I just think some of the shit that the you know, some of the, some of the stuff they say is uh, just funny. Just watching them. Yeah. Like literally, they're like because like each person plays like a different character in the raid mode, and sometimes they screw each other by you know, just. 
like tagging out to a person without, without telling them. Just because they got smacked to say. Let me see if I can find one of the videos I'm talking about, so that way I can see if it's the same people that you're referring to. I don't know why, but it's like, you, you, you say that, like, you know, the the whole, he got big, uh, you know, big head, no brain. My first thought was, like, the whole T-Rex thing, he's like, big head, little arms. <laughs> nah, but Ken got all arms. That's all he's got is just arms. Big arm. No, I just, look, I just imagine, right? You just... See, from the picture, we just see your upper body, right? Ken, Ken don't do leg day. <laughs> big, old, uh, big old upper body. L little legs. <laughs> I think his legs have to be decent, though. I mean, have you seen some people who... They, they see oh, pictures yeah. of people who just like work out the upper body. Arm day only. Arm day for. Nah, but Ken's really fast, so his legs have to be fast too. Yeah, I feel like he has some muscle on his legs. He might he not like... work them as much as arms though. He freaking teleported to Thaddeus's house. <laughs> so fast. I mean, I feel like that's that serial killer thing, you know, like uh, Jason and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Got there before the moped did. Mm -hmm. I say no, those aren't the guys that are watching, but he ain't too bad. Yeah, because when you described it, I was like, oh, I think I know who he's talking about. No, it's like apparently like each of them I guess have their own channels, but like Like, that's uh, one of the guys, because, like, they'll do these raids, and, like, each of them will do, like, they'll do one raid for, and one person will post it, then another person will do it, like, I guess technically they try them all three times, maybe more. I've actually never seen them complete a whole raid. So Iris, you, you, you join, but you, you know you're supposed to bring the entertainment, the the chattiness. Nah. Oh yeah, these are definitely some different dudes. Yeah. Not that I'll give chatty. this a watch. Cause Lord knows I got plenty of time on the night shift. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, like I, the, again, it, coming from someone who doesn't play, you know, fighting games or whatnot, I just I, I started watching some of them. Fighting games, what are those? I only know RPGs. You know, it's like know. you know the you know the arena uh, arena episodes we had? It's <laughs> kind of like that, except on a two dimensional screen. <laughs> without on dice. A two dim that sounds so weird. What? Without dice? How does I don't know how does is it even fun? How do you get anything done? Oh, yeah. Right. <laughs> it's like instead of dice rolls, you have to uh, roll for dexterity. Roll for dexterity. Just constantly. 
every few seems, seconds. And it's actually not every few seconds, every millisecond. And it's like you know, hope your you know, hope your hands don't cramp up on you. Uh, see, I suck at fighting games. I am limited to smash and smash only. Yeah, I'm only really good at smash. <laughs> okay. He's okay at Tekken. I'm but, back. Mm. I feel like Tekken's probably one of the easier ones to, like, get into at, like, a uh, beginner level, but it's harder to, like, master. Yeah, definitely. I don't know, to be honest, it's it's one of those, like, I, I've i played a few of the, the 360, like, you know, like the actual 3D fighting games, you know, where you got the whole arena to move around and whatnot. Like, a few of the oh. old, the, the few of the old Dragon Ball Z games were like that, what, what was this? Talking about PlayStation 2. Like Tenkaichi? I think so, yeah. Well, I'm back. Hey, Sean. Now that the hey, DM's hey. back, I gotta run. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she does that, as you know. Yep. She's going back into the chat to talk to herself. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's mean. I talk to her sometimes. A lot more, you know, Iris and. Lot less, you know, yeah, 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 yeah. I was saying maybe Iris could be an NPC because she misses playing. No, she's just a computer program. That's why she pops up on the screen like it is. Hmm. Oh, that's funny. So, uh, did you guys make a plan of what you're doing while I'm? Uh, we got sidetracked. Uh, uh, I mean, yeah, I'm gonna yeah, raid the yeah. goat. Yeah, I was, I was gonna say, yeah, kind of. <laughs> um, they gonna find a military base and just hack it. <laughs> that sounds about right. Yeah, kind of. Ken's gonna start getting changed. He's like, hey, Thaddeus, do you have any dark green cloth just lying around? That, that is it. Yeah, but... yeah, he's not back yet. Oh, no. Well, I'm gonna go into his linen closet and start ripping up some bed sheets that are like olive green. <laughs> I was about to say, I just imagine you see like, you see like dark green, uh, curtains. Uh, I'm just gonna start ripping it up and making a headband out of it. Buy some shoe polish. Uh, I'm gonna um, go in the refrigerator, and. Gather all the little Digimons around and just start feeding them random things. Yeah, like know. not like stuff that makes sense. Like I'm not giving them raw eggs or anything. <laughs> but like, yeah. Whatever I could find. If they'll if they'll drink ketchup, I'll give them ketchup. I'll make them cheese grilled cheese sandwiches. In the vegan fridge. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yep, it is. It's a vegan fridge. Um, Thaddeus, well then I guess they're getting vegetables. Thaddeus is setting up, so I'm, I'm just gonna... That's so, yeah, fine. It's just, it's just a whole bunch of vegetables, and, you know, you've got little, uh, Sunomon just going, nope. Well, um, <laughs> if I can find the least vegetable-looking thing, I ain't gonna tell him it's vegetables. He must have potatoes, come on. Hey, let's see if he's got any, you know, you know whatever I mind. mean, you can just tell him, like, it tell just tell them it's meat. Okay, you know, get meat the vegan. Grows in the ground. Get the vegan pizza, but don't tell Digimon it's vegan. Just, just. Well, see, that's your oven. plan. But it's like as soon as uh, Sudamon asks, Ken's just gonna come out and say, "Nah, bro, those are bell peppers. That's a vegetable." He's <laughs> gonna tell him like, like Ken's daddy told him as a kid: "Pick it off if you don't like it." <laughs> he just like scrapes everything off and it's just like the dough but like the dough's made out of like some some uh uh flax pole. seed yeah <laughs> next thing you know uh Sunamon comes out of the bathroom with like um what looks like to be you know candies but it is actually you come to find out just tums he's like oh look Ken Look what I found. Hmm. Candy. Hmm. Hey, look what I found. 
I don't know what it is, but it does not taste well. Until yeah, after well, you, you get... Might... Once you get past that, you know, that strange outer coating. Well, you know, little man, you're probably going to need some of those with all those taquitos you ate. <laughs> also, how did you eat a whole pizza? Yeah, Your body isn't good. even that big. I didn't eat it all. He left a slice. <laughs> yeah, he left one. Oh, how forgetful of me. <laughs> No, I left two. One for Padamon and one for Zazamon. <laughs> Get it right? They only had a slice each? <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's, I mean, I guess you, okay, I guess that's why they're in front eating the vegetables and not you. That's so funny. They're not eating the vegetables because they want to, they're eating it because they want to. I stuff on and loaded it up, so I'm I'm, I'm back. Is is Thaddeus' pizza ready? Yes. Oh, yeah. The pizza got pulled out and is uh being fed to the Digimon. <laughs> <laughs> they forgot about you. You might want to grab some like while you still can. Yeah. Okay. Uh, how 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 many slices are currently left? I'm like, 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 no, this, this, this is, there's four slices. All right, uh, Th Thaddeus is just gonna grab two of them. Like, you know, little, little, what is it, baby Patamon? I can't remember the Jokemon. He's gonna come over and do, like, the biggest puppy dog eyes to you. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, not even say a word, he's just staring there at you. But he also has a big, that big, gnarly, <laughs> big, grin. the big grin. To Tokomon, did did you get any of the other pizzas that came? Mom, I got one slice of the thing that Mo Sudoman mostly ate. Okay, have all of the other Digimon eaten? Uh, Mommy? So, I'm gonna need a slice too, and then he's eating some of that pizza. <laughs> Sunomon refuses to eat this one. He says he can smell them. Let's see, what was that? Kudamon? Was that Olivia's Digimon? That's mine. Has Kudamon gotten any pizza? I am currently fine, thank you for asking. And I've yet to de digivolve. In fact, I've yet to de digivolve the entire time I've been here, so I should be fine. Okay. Um. Then here you go, and that is going to take the other two slices and hand them to to Patamon. Here you go, bud. Why? So with that, we'll go ahead and say that everyone um, eats. And, uh, you know, gets a good drink of stuff. M makes y'all feel wonderful, right? Yeah. There you go. With, with full stomachs, um, you guys feel much better. Your Digimon feel better. Um, That's good. Though. After a little bit, they Digivolve back into Labramon, Patamon, and Gabumon. Do they have to? Yes. Oh. Conserve right, so, that energy. Well, well, they, they they did it because they they had the energy and they just kind of did it. Okay, dokies. Um, so real real quick question. Um, thinking thinking really hard about uh th this place that we live in. Is there a military base? Yes, there is. I would like to think about if I know where that is. Roll me a history check. You're not quite sure. 
You know there's one around here, but you're not quite sure where around here. So we need. Can I try to look it up on my phone? Here. Yeah. I do that. You find that this is the military base. Oh, good. We're really close to it. Awesome sauces. Um, hmm. All right, guys. So I think we should use the cover of night to go in there and investigate. Or I mean, I guess we'll wait and see because this update. What does the the update say that you were talking about, Thaddeus? Dad's. Yeah. What? I. Sorry. I finally just got my stuff plugged in how I need it to. What I miss. Um, you were talking about, uh, your phone did an update, and you think that... Okay, um, alright, con continuing with, with that then, since we're picking that up. Uh, so yeah, Thaz is gonna, Thaz is gonna check out what's going on with, uh, the phone. Um... Like, if you do One second. All right, so that is you're looking at the phone, right? Yes. So, of course, upon opening it, you know, it, it pops up. It says uh, rebuild, right? Version 1.0 beta. Okay. Um, you see a bunch of new tabs, um, it says, um, a bunch of new icons, one of them says Tamer. Um, upon going to try to click the Tamer button, nothing shows up, right? It says in insufficient data, right? But there's another button that you see that does interest you quite a bit. What does it say? It says Digigate. The icon. Uh, icon looks like that thing you saw before, right? Kind of like this weird circle with kind of data around it, but it's an icon. Um, upon clicking it, um, it's... Um, you click it and it says, Energy low. Recharging. Please come back in. And it gives... It tells... It then shows you a time code. It says... Uh, 2.30 p.m. tomorrow. That head sees this time code, and his, 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 he, he's not saying anything, but his eyes just went, like, wide. Well, what does it say? And Thaz is like still not saying anything. Just his his eyes are shifting and his mouth is like moving slightly. I'll move around and I guess look at his phone. Upon and notice at... the information that you had previously said. Yep. <sighs> so that means that based off of this, if this even works, we're not going to be able to even try to get back until tomorrow, and that's going to be probably like 24 hours, because that's around the time we got back today. Great. 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 <sighs> I wonder, is there like a... Is it like wirelessly charged or something? You got a charger? Can we make it go faster? Can we like, can you like lay your phone on top of my phone? <laughs> four years. Specifically, 
it would be three years, 11 months, and uh, I guess 14 days. Something like that. Um, upon you saying that uh, the room becomes kind of quiet, all the Digimon s um, kind of realizing what that means. Uh, the only one that doesn't uh, is Kudamon. He's just like, okay, so four years passes in the digital world. This gate doesn't open until that time. There's nothing you can do to change that. But we can be prepared. As long as we're still going, right, Olivia? We're still going, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, good. Then we can be prepared. <clears throat> I'm not excited about anything. Mm -hmm. Um... What time is it right now? Uh, in real life or in the game? In the game. 5.30 on the 6 o'clock. <sighs> Alright. Um, you're, you're right. There's... There isn't anything that we can do. We're just gonna have to wait. Gabumon's like, well, there is something we could do. Wait, can is it, is it raiding the base? Well, no. I was gonna go say try to find Parrotmon and punch him in the face, but raiding the base works too. You're right. There are two things we could do. Wait, why? Why are we gonna go punch him in the face? <laughs> wait, wait, wouldn't we you punch like him in the face? face? You know what, though? That is kind of clever thinking. But, hmm. We, what? Which clever well, thinking? It, Look, I'm going to be perfectly think, honest. I just see things that come out of my mouth. I don't actually think about them, so you're going to have to explain it to me. And that's if why you're they, my partner. <laughs> <laughs> if they haven't caught him yet, that means that they're looking for him. Right? And if we could find him and maybe use him as bait, maybe we could steal no. one of those fans. I, maybe, I or, get it. I or at least follow one. What we do is we leave. we're going to use him as bait, right? And then we're going to punch the old man in the face. You're a genius, Lily. A genius. I did not say that. Then but thank you. That's totally what you said, right? I'm gonna turn and look at Olivia. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, <laughs> um, I would, um, I would say we're normally not this crazy and, and hectic, but, um, I have no idea what you're talking about. We're always lie. this crazy and hectic. <laughs> mm. Yes, yes. Um, so, um, Pat, Good luck. Pat him on. Just, it's just like, yeah, but that means that there's never a dull moment, Olivia. That's true. And I have a feeling that we'll all become really good friends. I'm just really sad that we lost one. Yeah. Yeah. Nah, it's okay. I got a black bag. We'll get him back. <laughs> oh. My gosh! Um, is there a thing of is there a thing really is there a thing of friendship inside the black bag that'll make him remember and come back to us? Come on, Slate. Oh yeah. yeah. I don't think there is. It's a human. Oh, yeah, it really is. <laughs> Gabamon's just like yeah. My fist. <laughs> Alrighty, so. Thads, what are you doing? Thads is currently uh, hopped over to his laptop and he's literally looking up how to make a phone charge faster. 
There's nothing. It isn't about the battery on the phone being dead. There's not enough uh, data. It's trying to coalesce as much data as it can to create a digigate. Just have your phone download all the things out of your um, personal file. There should be plenty of data there. Uh, I... That's just gonna give a defeated sigh. All right. Um. Well, I guess like he's like Kunmon said. Can't do anything to change this, so we might as well just make sure we're as prepared as possible. Um. If anyone has any floppy disks that are still lying around at home. Okay, really, um, really Thaddeus. We, nobody uses those anymore. Ken is still in Thaddeus' bathroom cutting up some of his bed sheets and like crushing up some charcoal that he had to make like fake sh or fake uh, makeup and stuff. He's like, <laughs> alright, so are we still raiding the base or not? I, I don't know. I, I try not to laugh. This is serious. Um, I, okay. Alex, roll me perception. Oh, good. You notice. There is a black van parked here. Mm. On the side of it, Alex. Yeah. You see... This. Yeah. Kitty. I'm sorry, hold on. Everybody except for Alex, I need you to roll me. We're going to go with Arcana for right now because I don't have the, the other skill. Arcana? Oh, Arcana. God. Ken's about to fail that. Oh. Out of everything that I wanted to do well today. <laughs> okay, so. I mean, if you flip them. Thaddeus, you're free. You, you know, you're you're kind of down. Um, however, you're absorbed. Uh, you're absorbed. You know, everyone's absorbed in something else. Uh, Lily, that you notice that your phone is going off. Okay, okay. When you say going off, do you mean like it's ringing? I mean, it's beeping. I'll look at it. Upon looking at the screen, it says device located. Um, what color is the dot? Um, it doesn't show that kind of dot. It starts showing um, um, a bunch of tiny dots, right? Like over here and here and here and here. And what you you kind of start to surmise is that um, you're surrounded. Uh, oh god oh god oh god guys something's going on something's going on there's there's dots all around us i don't know like it said it said device located i don't know what kind of device um um can i uh, can i lock the door <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You lock maybe, the door. maybe push something in front of it like a Couch in there. Just in front of the door. Sit can on the couch. <laughs> Sit can on the couch. As he Can't puts on his please. black Air Force Ones instead of the Tims. <laughs> Thaddeus black just Air Force Ones indicate crime. Thaddeus just gets up like he's he's still like somber and he just walks to his bedroom. Um. Okay. 
Um, can I... In one of the directions, I guess... I want to see if I can, like, try to look out a window to maybe locate where one of the dots is coming from and see if I see something. Okay. You look out the window. You look towards where one of the dots is, and you just see... Um, you see this guy kind of sitting there. Um, he's got, like, a newspaper open. Like, sitting on a bench. Right? Yeah. Um, but it, it's something that you notice... He has a bag next to him, right? Mm-hmm. Roll me a perception. Or more sketch. Yep, you definitely know that that was it. Um you see this pop out of the bag. Like it just its head. Just kinda pops out of the bag and it's looking around as it goes back into the bag. You could have chosen something a bit more. Nope. Yep. Nope. That's not, that, that's not menacing. I don't want it to be menacing. Um. Understand this. It doesn't have to be menacing to be a menacing Digimon. T Tokomon is menacing. Yeah, you're right. I wouldn't count that. All right. Uh, he wants menacing, but he doesn't look menacing. All right, I'm gonna go back out in the main sitting living room area, and um, yeah, there's there's a guy He's sitting on a bench. He has a he's a bag, and I swear that a Digimon head popped out of it. He was he was blue. Okay, our animals aren't blue. I mean, naturally, you know. <laughs> So, so that means that those guys from earlier probably had Digivices just like we do, and they have Digimon. How many people here have Digimon? There is a whole lot of stuff that is going on that we don't understand, and I don't like it. <sighs> so yeah, I, I think pretty much we're surrounded. So, um, we probably shouldn't try to leave. Oh my god, Alex. <laughs> of course there's police sirens in the background. I swear. <laughs> no, I just think it's ironic timing. Um... <laughs> so at this Kitty. point, you all notice Ken has changed into his yeah. sneaking costume. Oh, I... That's that's coming from you. Me? Kitty. Yeah? The background noise. Thank you. I can but hardly hear people. That wasn't me. I never said, no, I didn't say you, I said kitty. Oh, okay. Yeah. Sorry. We also don't have any music. But, um, I shall fix this. So, so yeah, Ken, um, I see your sneaking outfit. Very nice, very sharp. Um, we're surrounded by, uh, unknown individuals right now. That probably have Digimon. Uh, baby form Digimon, possibly, maybe. I don't know. There might be a mixture. Who knows? So I don't know if we should leave. And now I'm even more worried about Alex. So that's great. What if they took him? They probably took him. All right, Thaddeus, I got some questions for you. Oh, yeah, he was really sad. And he walked away into his room. All right, well, in that case, I'm going to go into his kitchen and see about some cleaning uh, and about what? And a pen. Mm, I don't. I don't know about this. <laughs> so.
so, oh gracious DM. Mm -hmm. yeah. You guys hear me? I can hear you. Yeah. Oh. Hold on. I think the volume of the music on my end is... Okay. Yeah, the music volume was way louder than everybody else. Uh. Uh. Am I able to check under his sink to see if he has ammonia and bleach? <laughs> Yeah, that's where I thought it was going. <laughs> Roll me investigation. <laughs> okay. I'm so done with you all. <laughs> <laughs> you find the bleach. Man, it's fight or flight right now. <laughs> it's like, oh, I it doesn't have ammonia in here. I could still do some stuff with bleach. <laughs> oh, good lord. Things just took a dark turn. With your um, battle plan. Yeah, can see... I, can I check to see if he has any little squirt spray bottles under his sink? Yeah, he has them. Alright. I start pouring some bleach into one of the squirt bottles. Okay. Thaddeus is gonna come out of his room and get that he he looks over and sees Ken doing that. He's like, "What are you doing with the bleach?" Hey Thaddeus, do you have any ammonia? Tell him no. <laughs> no. What What are you trying to do? You oh, know we're surrounded. What are you trying to do? We're surrounded, and the feds ain't getting me. <laughs> I Not, mean... again. <laughs> Not again. Not <laughs> again. Jeez. Goodness gracious. <sighs> okay. <sighs> Daddyus, do you have pneumonia? I feel like he he is heavily weighing his odds. Of, <laughs> man, do I want to let him get away with this? Give, give me just a moment. To be fair, anybody who's watching either in the stream or on YouTube, we do not condone any of these actions. <laughs> no. no, we don't. Yes, please don't do these things. Remember, stay in school. Don't do drugs. Crack is whack. <laughs> This has become a after school special now. <laughs> and whatever you do, kids, do not mix household chemicals. You could yeah. potentially die. How, uh, uh, was it? Uh, Officer McGruff walks in <laughs> along with Smokey the Bear. I'm just going to say this right now. This, this, this episode is probably going to get hit real hard. Meh. Why'd you just throw a Molotov out the window, huh? I mean, to be fair, it's not like we're trying to make money off of this. I mean, I'm not, but. Just doing this for fun, but still. It's a good this thing one. I put this is not for children. <laughs> no, see, okay. that's the thing. You label this episode as, you know, adult <laughs> I mean, I don't know of anything in my house that's specifically ammonia. I guess I'm like, um, yeah, but... I will position myself behind Ken, shaking my head no the whole time. Me too. I'm, I'm pretty sure. I, I'm pretty sure I don't have any ammonia. Oh, okay, that's all right. At the very least, anything that would have ammonia wouldn't be in sufficient quantities in order for you to um have your no no permanent night night juice. <laughs> it's one of those. All right, everyone, quickly. We need to gather up all the pee. Oh, no, <laughs> no. Oh my god, you're not here! You left! Um, oh! <laughs> Quick, everyone you're... gather the Dragon Balls. Uh, Ken, you're pretty strong, right? No. No. Yeah, yes, he's strong! I'm not. Yes. Well, I mean, real world as opposed to digital world. No, I didn't carry you back. 
Oh, you carried well, me. Well, nice thank you. you. <laughs> um, well, we've got my door is a reasonable choke point, so we can try to funnel him. And I might not have ammonia, but you already got the bleach out. I've got some rags whoa, and nail polish. Whoa, 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 guys, Ooh, guys. I no, did not think of whoa, that. I was just going to try and no, blind no, him. No, no, really Nobody's even knocking at the door yet. <laughs> we, are we talking about <laughs> all-out warfare? Yay! I did not know that was a thing. <laughs> no, no, absolutely no. not. Absolutely not. We're not funneling anybody. These no. At this point, Lily just opens the window. Hey, you over there! Please come get us. <laughs> Ken please. was just going to try and blind them with please. the bleach. Please take us. Oh my please God. take us. Just, I'm just imagining Lily's like, that's it. Just, just throw in the SWAT team. Take us now. We'll, we'll go willingly. But please throw in knockout gas first. Um, says this okay, might be a okay. little overkill and starts putting hot sauce in the bottle of bleach. Oh, good. Okay. In, in Thaddeus' defense, we're, we're discussing the topic of someone breaking into his home. No, we said that we were surrounded. Yes. In Ken's defense... He did just and, say he was going to break into a government base, and now the feds surrounded him. <laughs> so, stand your ground. I mean, I don't think it's because you said that. I think it's because they can read our dingy vices just like we can read theirs. I don't know, man. Ken is a wanted felon. Do we even know if they're hostile? I'm going to assume they are. I, I, um, I have no idea. I'm open to the possibility of them being friendly, but I'm gonna be prepared in case they aren't. That's why I went into my room. Into this point, you hear. I'm gonna go and and get on the couch quietly that I put in front of the door, and I'm gonna Wait. look through the people. Guys, can we? I'm going to go room, back into the kitchen him. and start posting up. So, as you do this, you see a gentleman, he's wearing the, you know, black outfit. Doesn't have anything over top of him. And he's just standing at the door going. I know you're in there. You have currently unregistered Digimon. Please. Come out with your hands up, so that we may register you tamers. Can I ask who's speaking, and with what authority? I am Lieutenant Commander Cross of DISC. Heck no. Oh, no. <laughs> Why? Why? It was, the nah, nah, it was literally nah. the first name that popped into my head. Nah, That's I won't. Thing. You. Won't this is that. a completely different world with completely different things. You can't. You cannot judge him based off a name. Watch me try. Out. In it, like out of character, you can judge him. In character, you cannot. Um, and shouts out. You can crisscross and cha cha slide off this lawn, homeboy. Um. But oh, yeah. I'm, I'm, that, that is because that is was unconscious. That is gonna look over and be like. Y'all said something about the feds. What he's talking about? What you guys are referring to? Ken, snar Ken starts down and says, "All right, it's game time." He, he I want to register so, he, the he, Digimon and not for anybody else, but for your own safety. However, if you do not come with me peacefully, you'll be branded as terrorists and dealt with as such. You'll forgive me for wanting to take a moment. We've kind of been through a lot lately. Give, give me, give me just a moment, Lily. Do, do you know what this guy's talking about? No. Disc. No, I don't know anything about registering Digimon. Can start putting sand in his pocket. Where did he get sand from? Pocket sand. No pocket sand for you. Soil from a house plant or something. 
Can can I? Th Th Thaddeus is going to uh, is going to look up. He's going to try to look up the the organization did like on the on the laptop. Thaddeus, did you have a cat? <laughs> Fuck his hand. Fuck his hand. Oh my god! That ain't saying his kitty litter. Oh, why 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 are you asking about Miss Tipsy? Pocket sand. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I, I don't put some of that kitty litter and put it in my pocket. Kitty litter. Oh. Anyways. <laughs> in Thaddeus' defense. Look, when you look it up, the only thing that you can find out about Disc is that it was that whatever it was came up about a month ago, or two months ago. It's it's a new it's a new brand branch of the government. What it does, not really known. That's that's fine. As long as Thaddeus is able to find something to verify that this is actually a thing, Thaddeus uh, is gonna be like, "Well, guys, from what I can tell, it's at the very least it's an official government agency. So I guess I should open up." No, let's no. How do you register the Digimon? that we First don't off. totally have. <laughs> How do you register the Digimon yeah, that I totally have. don't have them? I didn't say. You do. That's what I really know. Look, you do some paperwork, you get to keep your Digimon. As long as you don't use them, there's no problem. Though, you can always put in an application at disk. Look, we're doing this for the safety of the people. Digimon are Wait. dangerous weapons. Wait, 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 wait. You mean we could come in and do paperwork? Yes. Look, you have a bunch of unregistered Digimon in one place. I came prepared. I'm gonna whisper this to everyone so that I can't hear it. I'm like, I know you're not gonna like this idea, but didn't you guys want to know more about them and infiltrate their place anyway? Um, and yeah, okay, just, just, in. just give us, give us a couple minutes, um, I kind of barricaded the door. Very well, make it quick. I don't think you really have much of a choice. Alright, so, um, <clears throat> I'm gonna look Ken in the face. No bleach. No. no pocket sand. No whatever else you got. You just see yeah. Gabumon, like, behind him, like, She didn't say I couldn't do <laughs> this to them. They're, they're not really uh, the top, so I don't think they'll know about you, Ken. They're, like, different. Nope. Say that. All I know is if uh, if the fighting starts, <laughs> he's getting bleach and hot sauce in the eyes. No bleach. All right, look, let's just move the couch away from the door and let's go with him. Be being cautious, understanding that it could still be a trap. Okay, and um, let's try to see if we can bust up into this place. Hopefully they let us go early enough that we can get more taquitos before we go back to the digital world. That would be good. Um, I guess if we're prepping for that, I, uh, everyone real quick try to see if we can generate some D-points just in case we need the extra firepower. Wait, crap, I just thought of something. Because I've got stuff to take, and then it's going to look weird if I take it with me. Hmm... Damn, that was a little my 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 right. backpack full of things that I stole from my mother. <laughs> no. I'm. I mean, I still have my uh my safe unlocked, so you can store it in there. Well, see, the the whole hire. point was to try and get there and use that because, like, apparently they have a way to send things back to the digital world was to use that to get to the digital world faster. I would need to take the stuff with me. But wouldn't that look super obvious? Yes, that's what I just said. 
Yeah. Kunamon's kind of like, look, if we can, while we're there, I say we slip in. We use whatever machine they are to transport us all to the digital world. If we can't, then we come back here, grab the stuff, and use the gate tomorrow as planned. Mm -hmm. I agree. So, um... Before we leave, just to like, I can't, I can't open my inventory, can I, and put things in it? No. <laughs> okay, just you know, make sure before we leave. No, the update gave you, gave you a much more stable readout from your redial, but it's not. You still can't pull anything or do anything that you could have done in the digital world. Okie dokie. Um. Yeah, I guess. I don't know. I'll start moving the couch. And is there a chain on 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 this door? Yes. I want to chain lock it. <laughs> if I hadn't already done that, and I want to open the door and look at this individual real good in the face before I open open the door. Okay. You do this, you look at him, he looks back at you. Are you coming out? Or do I need to come in? We're coming. I just, you know, just being cautious, you know. Cautious. <sighs> I'll open the door. As long as you aren't a threat, there's nothing you need to be worried about. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, I've heard things like that before. I'll open the door. So, as you're opening the door, you know, the guy looks at you and goes, Look very well. I'm gonna need you and your Digimon to go down that street and get in the truck. Please follow the sidewalk and crossroad signs. Don't stray. We'll know. Hmm. <sighs> I'm gonna start walking down the side. <laughs> Just do that. Labramon follows you. Do, does everybody else go with their Digimon partner? Can I pick her up and carry her? Yes. Right. You lying son of a bitch. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? It wasn't me. That wasn't me. Um, I want background TV. Do we, do we see the exact same logo that we saw before on them? Yes. Okay. Just making sure. Yeah, this is definitely members of DISC. Mm. Um. Mm. Ah. Woof. So you guys uh, go and, you know, you get into the, the van, right? Hey, Alex, what are you doing? Yeah, what happened to Alex? Well, you know. Uh, Alex and Croc down the, uh, at a party. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Alex is across town at a party while this all happens and goes down. You didn't even try the phone? There we go. All right. You all get transported via the back of the truck, right? As you all do, uh, it takes a, not too long, actually. It only takes a couple of minutes, and eventually uh, you can feel the truck stop. Uh, the door is open. Some men usher you out, and as they do, you see the same gentleman from before, right? Okay. Still carrying her. Um, you 
You notice that uh, as they pull you out, that same gentleman from before, the one with the white hair, he uh, he's kind of standing there, just looking at his phone. He answers it. Hello. Hello. Hey, um, what's going on? It's strange for you to call me like this, Alex. I'm busy with work. Yeah, you know, um, uh, I'm in a little trouble down here. I was wondering if, uh, you know, I wouldn't call you if I didn't need it. What do you need? Well, there's a bit of an accident, and currently I'm down at, you know, well, I'm down at the big house. I will be there shortly. Yeah, if you could hurry, I mean... Uh, the, apparently there's a guy in the cell that they're going to put me in named, uh, you know, Big Bubba. And I don't want to, I don't want to get to know Big Bubba. Yes, I understand. Like I said, I'll be there very shortly. <sighs> Bye, Alex. Yeah, yeah. Thanks. He Bye. hangs up the phone, right? Puts it in his pocket, turns around to see all of you. Well... It looks like our little chat will have to wait. I have some very important business to attend to. However, Cross, come here. Make sure that they are fine. I told you not to bring them in with that face of yours. Uh, I didn't catch your name, sir. Yes, of course. Very sorry. My name is Brigadier General Steele. Oh, like, like Alex Steele? Upon you saying that, he kind of cocks an eyebrow. So, you know my son. Yeah, but, I don't know, I guess it's a bit of a long story. Well, be sure to tell, you can be sure to tell me that story when I get back. I have urgent business to attend to. Give them the rundown, and don't skimp on any of the details. With that, you know, he uh, he walks away, uh, seemingly gets into his car and drives off. Uh, the one you guys were talking to before is like, this way. That way we can get started on the paperwork. He leads you into a uh, kind of a large room. Okay, uh, leads you into a uh, some. It's a nice room, right? Or chairs. It looks like that this is a place that people have. It looks like a waiting room, right? He points down. Have a seat. I'll bring your paperwork to you shortly. He leaves, and it's just you guys in the room. Um. Well, I'm not going to sit down. <laughs> I am. Bring that. I'm <laughs> scared to move. <laughs> I'm going to start looking for surveillance equipment in the room. Yeah, me too. And doors. You do see the, um, you see the door that you came in and two other doors. One to the left and one in the back. Um, surveillance equipment, you see one camera. Does Ken still have his bleach and hot sauce? He does not. Uh, did they take off Ken's stuff when he came in? Yes. Oh, no. 
you have Sunomon and your phone. <laughs> Sunomon, your phone, and your redial. Dang, they took my shoes oh, I'm sorry. too. They, they, <laughs> you, you, so your redial and your and your decoder. My bad. I feel like the only the only the only, the only prep you may still have is your pocket sand. You know your kitty litter. They saw that. I can't mess with the camera with that. <laughs> wait, wait. So just the stuff that was in my bag, or the stuff that I had in my pockets as well, and like what was on my person. Look, they took anything that would have been dangerous or deadly and left it in the truck. Okay. But yo, Ken. Wait, is that? Do you have Gabumon or Sunomon? Gabumon. Sunomon. So wait, if they took everything deadly and left it in the truck, why am I there? <laughs> <laughs> He's got these guns, yeah. Gabumon's like looking at, uh, looks at you. Ken is just like, I think we could take it. So do one of them. He's like looking at the camera as it moves. Keeps looking at me. It's a strange looking Digimon, I tell you. Never seen Digimon with one eye before, but not a rotating body like that. I don't know what it's doing. They'll see you break the camera, though. They'll yeah, see I me know. if I use Blue Blaster. He's like, Blue. <gasps> And Ken just puts his hand over Gabumon's <laughs> mouth. There's probably someone watching us at this point. Mm. Alright, Sunamon, let's sit down. I mean, you could pull the old I gotta go to the bathroom trick if you want. Gabumon sits down next to Ken. Ooh, cool. He's empty comfy. Maybe these guys aren't so bad. Anyways, um, Patamon kind of looks at Thaddeus. What's gonna happen to us when we're registered? I mean, with any, with any luck, it'll just be that. that kind of like how we, uh, how we do pets in this world, where. Uh, kind of like when someone has an apartment, you register the pet, and it's just... Then they know that you have a pet. There might be, I don't know, some kind of fee, but should be fine. I'm just a little curious about, uh, that whole application with DISC. If it's something that would be worthwhile, what it pays. Because that would give us some liberties just in case there's any more of those digital incursions i would hate for us to get in trouble for just trying to defend ourselves so if the way to get around that is to get a job it's not the worst way to make money yeah well i don't plan on staying here long enough for all that so lily you're kind of chilling out near one of the doors, you know, everyone's kind of spread out, you're holding Labramon. Um, you and Labramon notice you can hear something behind the door closest to you. I will definitely listen. Okay. And as will she. Yeah. As you guys uh, kind of get closer and just kind of listen to the door, um, you just hear uh, Cross is standing there uh, talking to someone and he's just like, I thought I told you to turn it on. But the general said, I told you to turn it on. Sir, we can only open them every 24 hours. Uh, trying to rush them in, that could be problems. Last time we tried to rush, there were massive incursions all over the place. Data spikes everywhere. I said, turn it on. Can I do something foolish? What are you doing? Uh, opening the door and rushing in there. Oh, Toby, the door's locked. <laughs> it's locked. Is it locked? Is the door yes, locked? It is, so you rattle the handle as you try to burst in there. 
uh, one I will start pounding on and say, don't do it, don't do it. The door open, you know, cross opens the door, he looks at you and he's... Oh, I did put Labramon down. <laughs> he just looks at you. Don't do what? I could hear you in there. You Do you have any idea, like, what that is doing out there? As long as I take care of the problem, it really doesn't matter. You didn't well, take care of one of the problems we did. I'm pretty sure General Steele would beg to differ. It already seems like you have a little bit of a loose cannon pro complex, and that he's already tried to put you in your place on that before, so... I don't really advise going against him much more. Honestly, didn't we take care of more than one? Don't we have a better track record than these guys currently? I wouldn't yeah. say that. We haven't had a whole lot of research on them, but... And also, that being know. said, this is a government facility. How are you going to have walls this thin that we can just hear you through them? <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. I want to know hilarious. how come they weren't there when we were. Well, I don't want to say, but why weren't they there earlier? I mean, to be totally fair, we were literally on site for both yeah. of those. That's true. Hold on, really quick. Did you just say that out loud? Or were Who, you me? talking out of character, Thaddeus? I... Uh, well, that depends entirely on whether what Olivia Amy, said was out loud. Were you talking? I, I was saying that in character, but kind of hushed. Okay. Oh, but that's why I, didn't say, say I don't want to say. But yeah. Thaddeus yeah. didn't say hushed. He just went. Well, to be fair, we were on site for both of them. Into which Cross is going to look at you and go, You were there for both of them? Well, there were two incursions that. Maybe we, we stop talking and giving the guy information that we know nothing about. I thought it was more than two, but all right. No. Uh, guys! <laughs> yes! <laughs> They're already going. Either so, way, what what is the point of opening to go to, I guess, the digital world? What is the point of doing that? You think I'm opening gates? What are you doing then? Since you're making a heck of a mess out in our city. Well, what I'm doing is opening the gate and sending bombs through. What? Bombs? Yeah. So you're see, and here's the thing, I'm gonna tell Cro. I'm gonna. <laughs> Sorry, <hold on. laughs> I'm going to tell Steel that I processed you and let you go. Mm, I think I'd rather talk to General Steel. Oh, I'm sure you would. But see. I don't need any more tamers walking around. Look, I made a simple mistake by talking right there. But I needed it done now. I only have a little time while Cross... Uh, dang it. Well, Steel isn't here. Hey, quick question. Is that door still open? No, he shut it behind him. Ah, dang it. But All did right. he lock it? Who knows? <laughs> we have a door punching expert, okay? <laughs> and that door's not very thick because we can hear through it. So, so anyways, <laughs> um, what's your next move, sir? Um. As he does that, you notice that uh, the door behind him does open, right? And two. Sealstromon come in. Oh. 
So now there are two seals drawn with cross. Um, Quick yeah. question, how fast are these things? They're pretty fast, to be perfectly honest. Are they faster than me? They're champions. So yes. Oh. Alright. Um... One second. So, anyways, um... <laughs> so, anyways... Um, Cross, of course, looks at the two of them and goes, Don't kill them yet. Tie them up. We're going to throw them through the gate. Oh, no. Don't do that. With that, he uh, clicks a button on a small device that he has. You notice that the uh, Seelstromans uh, begin to get ready and start start coming at you with uh, with some rope. As uh, he starts to make his exit. As he starts walking away, I say, So you said your first mistake was talking to us tamers, right? He stops for a second, turns around. It was. Yeah, and your second mistake was turning around. Pocket sand! <laughs> <laughs> There you go. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> One second. That's great. Nah, he fails. Um, it goes into his eyes. He's like, ah, oh, what the hell? Ah. He's like, like kind of in the middle of the door. The sand's in his eyes. He's like, the hell is this? Ah. Oh. It's you, kitty little big boy. <laughs> I hope you get an infection. All right, so um, as this happens, an alarm starts going off on the base. Right? Soldiers start uh, start hearing the soldiers are mobilizing. Right? He's just like, oh, now you've done it. What did you all do? Couple uh, ones like, so I don't know what that sounds means, but I think that means we should go. Yeah, let's let's run, run, go, 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 go. Everyone, me. Yeah, that that was from okay. earlier. That's fine. Everybody, roll me athletics. Oh, why, why is it always gotta be athletics? Because today you guys have been doing athletic stuff. Yes. No. Yes, I like the things that you know. I'm an individual who hold likes on, to hold dip on, and hold dodge. On, hold, on, hold on, hold on. I want to know why it is that the majority of us <laughs> keep rolling the same number. <laughs> well, to be fair, it's, it's like, like y'all are rolling different numbers. Olivia <laughs> got away. Modifiers. But you yes. Like, <laughs> I'm so down, like, like yo. I'm about to get so high on athletics. <laughs> <laughs> tell her tell Olivia I'm gonna go so fast <laughs> so <laughs> Olivia like she like jumps over and through and it's like out the door Kudamon's just like yes good job Olivia <laughs> um as the rest of you try to run out Ken uh Gabumon runs right in front of you and it's just like Nuke let's go so it takes you a little bit to try to get out. Um, the Sildramon, they're not, they're not following you. They don't seem to be doing anything currently. Um, not sure why, but they're not doing anything. Um, so you start going down the hall. Um, you all are going down the hallways. You all do get away, but Olivia is significantly ahead of you all. That's the adrenaline. <laughs> <laughs>
She doesn't know where she's running, but she sure is running. Come on. Alright. So, uh, as you, uh, you, you're just running down a hallway, okay? You see a left and a right turn. Which way are you going? Um, left. All right. You make a left turn. Right? Start running. Everyone else, you come to the same the same intersection and have seen Olivia take a left. What do you do? Yeah, I'm going to I'm going to go left. Left. All right. Grab Ken and make him go left as well. <laughs> you guys I'm just seeing the cha cha so I say slide to the left. So, you guys <laughs> keep running. Um Olivia, you come to a a double door. What do you do? See if I can open it. Uh, you easily open it. As you do, you're now outside, right? Oh. Um. Is there anything out there? Um. Yeah. Um. Off in the distance, you do see a few people. You know, people with the black outfits on. I'm I'm running back in quickly and closing the door again. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna like run back to the other guys and go. That just goes outside, and there's people out there. Uh, turn around, and start going the other so... way. But that was outside. That means we're going deeper into the place. Look, I'm all for raiding the place, but um, there were two commander mines. Well, I'm sorry, seers mines. My bad. And none of us are currently champion. I mean, you know, we've beaten champions Didn't with rookies beat up before. Well, we gotta make a decision now. Are we gonna try to go back? Or are we gonna run away? <sighs> oh, that's right. I was it only able to beat like up Leomon because I stole Bearmon's soul. You wanted to go to. Wait a second. So, as you guys are uh, kind of sitting there talking, um, you hear footsteps coming from down the hallway, right? Oh, oh no. You hear them. They're coming. Uh, turning the corner is Alex. No. Oh. What? Where's what are you doing, doing here? Uh, look, look, um, look, just go follow me this way. Okay. Let's go. Uh, okay, let's go. Uh, let's go. Oh, oh, now we're supposed to be y'all friendly and listen to each other. Just shut up and follow me. <laughs> Don't tell me to shut up. This is why nobody likes you. Lily, come on, let's go. I was already oh, headed in that direction. <laughs> Just know if you're lying to us, I'm going to throw sand in your eyes. <laughs> All right, let's go then. So you guys start heading down the way, right? Um, You come to a... Uh, Another intersection, a left and a right fork, but they look like they're going to end up either going because that it goes left and right, and then they both go straight after that. Uh, do I remember the way I got in here? Um, you remember that you took a right. So I'm going down the left hallway. Yep. So you take him down the left, right? You keep going, you keep going. Um, as you're coming to the, the where you had come in from, right? Um, yeah. You can hear guards are now coming from that direction. From the way I came in from? Yes. Okay. Um, from anything that I saw, do, could I try to put where I could find the garage? Um... You know like that there the might be a garage if you were to go back and to the right. Okay. All right, guys. Uh, new plan. Other way. Did you see the funny you this way? Look, 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 look. That way people are coming. We're, we're going to go try to find the garage. Get in one of the vans. Get out of here. Oh, okay. <laughs> So, Where's guys... General Seal? 
Look, I don't, I don't know. Let's worry about getting out of here. Anyway, so you guys go down that way. Um, going that direction, you guys open this door to a very large circular room, right? In this room, you see Dokugumon, right? Wrapped and bound. You see one guy kind of right there as he starts powering up this thing. You see this thing begin to spin as a digigate starts to form. Um, as it keeps spinning in this digigate forms, you notice that data starts coalescing beside you and around you guys. Gabumon's like, I feel a little tinky. I don't think we should let it continue. Patamon's like, I'm getting a really bad vibe. And Labramon, for the first time in her entire life, is snarling. Can I run at that dude? That's controlling the machine? Yes. I do that. Okay, you run at him. Uh, he doesn't even notice, so I'm not even going to make you make an athletics. Because he's, you know, paying attention to the machine, activating it, paying attention to the levels. And then you just tackle him. <laughs> Boom! He hits the ground. He's like, oh, what the? He's like, get off of me! Thads is going to run up to the controls. I'm going to run up on the guy and start stomping on so him. As, he, as you guys start doing this, he's just like, like looking and he sees he's trying to get away as he does he accidentally hold on actually let's see if he does this someone tell me high or low low okay uh he goes to kick and barely misses a cord right mm -hmm. um freaking out ken starts hitting him he starts trying to uh lift and move so he grabs ken as ken is attacking him so ken it's going to be your Acrobatics or athletics versus his acrobatics or athlete or his athletics. Okay. You yeah, boy. Yeah, so he me. goes to goes <laughs> he goes to try to grab you and you just like kick his arm out of the way. Uh, Thaddeus, as you're doing this, you know you see the the system. Um, you notice that Dokugamon is now almost fully into the gate, like entrenched in it. Right. You notice mm. that the gate is starting to change color. It's turning more purple. There's little bits of red data. You notice error codes are now appearing. Yeah. Um, on the computer before you pat him on. It's like, we gotta do something! Yeah, bud, you gotta do, do, do the right thing. Can, can, can we try to grab him? Like, I, I'm gonna get off for this dude. And has him. Uh, can we try to pull him like back onto our side out of the portal? He's a big dude. I realize how big he is, or she, you know. But did did you did you mind help? And Patamon's like, can can any of us did you Uh, yeah. Uh, you ready, Patamon? Hold on. Mine can. Oh, you. Um, all of you could digivolve if you wanted to. Yeah. All right. Um, yeah. So all of them, you know, you kind of hit it, you activate it. They all digivolve, right? Um, Darkmon's the first one because she flies in. She grabs one of the arms. She's trying to pull it down, you know, trying to pull Dokugamon. It's just like most of it's in this portal and it's just like, let me go. You're not going to be able to pull me out of the portal. You know, Garudamon, you know, leaps up there, grabs the other arm by biting into it. It's like just hanging there, <laughs> you know, trying to add weight to pull them down. Um, uh, Wizardmon, uh, using his magic, is trying, like, lassos around one of the other free legs and is trying to pull. And, uh,. <clears throat> Repamon is trying to help by doing his best to pull down as well. The, you guys try your best. I do need... So you guys are actually going to have to pull up your, your champion Digimon for me. Um, I got mine. And then I need you to roll me um, just strength checks. Straight strength checks. Because they're trying to pull him out of the, the portal. That's good. Uh... 
If, if, if Wizardmon is yeah, using Wizard, Arcana, look, can he... Yes, he can use his wisdom. Use wisdom, okay. Or, no, his intelligence, because he's using his... He's using his magic, so he can use his intelligence. Sweet. So, so I'm helping, because I'm helping. Do you want me to roll? <laughs> you can roll... You can roll again because you're you're gonna use the help action. Oh, I just that I'm literally. Oh, you're helping. also helping. So you like jumped up. You're like grabbing. You're like. Nah! Um. Combined, um, you you all are able to pull. You you're able to start pulling Dokugamon out. But even pulling him out, he is still being pulled up into the machine. You're not sure why none of you guys or the Digimon, like your Digimon, are not being pulled in like Dakugamon is, right? But he's being pulled. Currently, he's about two feet from the mouth of the portal now. But it's still, uh, it's still pulling. And in fact, it's starting to pull harder. And instead of turning that just purple color, it's becoming red and running faster as the portal starts to crackle with more energy. But right, he, uh, he's he's not in it, right? He is not in it anymore. There, is there right, a that, rewind button up here? Yeah, Th 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 that's the reason why Thads wasn't helping. Thads is looking at the control battle to see if there's any resembling an off switch or anything that would look familiar to him you of how to shut it down. You see a, a very large, like... A Uno okay, card. Kitty, you know how in, like, movies or TV shows they always have that, like, um... What is it? The lever that you slowly crank <laughs> up? Oh, yeah. And it's got one of those. Um, Currently, so this one... it's, it's set up to maximum. Okay, so it's it's like a fader, not like a dial. Yeah. Alright, uh... Thads is going to slowly bring the fader down. So as you try doing that, you notice that it's locked in place. It's, it's, it ain't moving? Not yet. Uh... One second. You notice something pops up on the screen, right? Mm-hmm. One minute till critical failure. Oh, boy. Oh, God. Um, 59. Yo, know, is there a power switch? 58. Uh, power cord? You know, we unplug it, something? 57. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, wait, what? No, okay. no, he's just going to sit here and keep typing that. Come on, Thaddeus. Is there... Uh, hold on. Is there any kind of a fail-safe button? Not that you can see. Uh, Make Thaddeus the dude fix it! Yeah, I was gonna say, is Ken able to intimidate the guy into telling him how to stop it? Roll intimidation. Okay. Whoa, buddy. Hold on, hold on. Wait, oh no, because it's it not part of Patamon, it's part of Wizardmon. Oh. No, he has. He still has Bounce Blood. Okay, yes, you can re-roll it. Alright, hold on one sec. No, he's not intimidating. He's just like, he's just looking at you like, <laughs> I already wanted to blow up the digital world. Uh, Thaddeus is going to to check his read aisle to see if he can pull anything out of his inventory, given all the crap that's going on. No. I'm going to go over to the guy and he's like, look, buddy, if you don't help us, uh, this guy right here is just going to throw you into the portal. You want to be on the other side when the world gets blown up? And after that guy says what he said earlier Sir. and laughed, Thank I punch you. him in the face for laughing. What was that cord that you were trying to kick? Just pull it! We're running out of time! Hey, you skipped a second right there. I know I did. <laughs> So you're pulling oh, that, the that, cord? That, that, no, no, that, that is. Is there any that, any buttons up there? 
Yeah, are there any other buttons that I can discern what they do? Oh, there are a lot of buttons. Press that I can discern what they do. Um. Not particularly. Where, where's that cord lead to? To right under the panel. To right under the panel. Wait, the panel where the portal is or the panel where, you know... So, like, if the uh, control panel and then the... That's not fair. We're asking questions. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. When you when you say that the the thing is locked in place, is it like there's a spot for a key, or it's just not budging? As far as you know, it's just not budging. Is there is there is there a spot like a keyboard up there where you know something pops up that says password? Punch a screen or something, please. <laughs> I mean, Rahman, you could also try... the cord. Do it. So, I have a hypothetical question. Is Ken able to get up, right? Mm. Grab the dude by his feet and, like, sling his body at where the cords are? <laughs> Just... I mean... Just kind of yeet him at them. I mean, They'll the come cord, undone by his weight. The cord's right by your foot. Because he was almost able to kick it. Do you just want to kick it and unplug the cord? I mean, I could, but it would be funnier if I tried throwing him at them. Okay, well, you throw... Yeah, you, you can pick him up and chuck him at the cords. You do that? Yeah. Okay, as you do, the entire panel goes dark. Hey. Is the thing stopping? And the portal gets stronger. Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> However, Ken? You get, now you can't see the countdown timer. Great. Ken, I love you. Probably wasn't the best idea. So Garurumon is actually going to let go and drop to the ground, right? As he hits the ground, he's just like, Can I just blow this thing up? Sure. Ken's like, yeah, go ahead. And with that, you know, he, he starts, he fires a uh, howling blaster at a uh, at the the, the, the the ring, right? Mm -hmm. Still pulling. Hold on. Here's what we're going to do. It doesn't have a thing, but I want to see how much damage this Howling Blaster would have done. Right? 24. All right, so he does that. He keeps firing at it. You notice that it starts slowing down the gate, but not enough. Darkmon, attack it! Okay. Rip him on, you too. Hold on. That's the case. We're gonna friggin' let go of the guy, though. I'm not. <laughs> not that I'm doing much. Oh, they, I forgot. They're, they're, they're fully healed and have all the good things back. Okay, so... Ripmon's gonna use Sky Fissure Slash. And Darkmon's gonna use Bat Fume. more. Save you can't even say it! Save me. Shut up. Because I'm, I'm looking at two whole things. Shush. So with that, you know, you guys hit it and something breaks off from the, the gate, right? As mm. it breaks off from the gate, it just starts kind of circling and spiraling in to itself. It eventually closes, leaving a small fissure of data, right? That eventually does dissipate slowly over time. Um, and uh, Dakugamon lands on... You know, lands onto the ground, and it's just like on Lily. Well, on on top of like <laughs> Garurumon, he's just like <laughs> Garurumon's like. <laughs> I didn't know you were so heavy. <laughs> Dokugumon kind of like gets up and like looks around, looks at all of you. Why? Why did you not let them send me back to the digital world? It didn't seem right. It didn't seem safe, and... They were going to send you through like a bomb. They were going to what? I mean, that's kind of what it sounded like, yeah. Mm, I knew that Parrotmon would get me into trouble! I mean, it's not Parrotmon's fault, it's their fault. You know, I like the whole reason I'm here! 
Yeah. What do you they mean? They started fighting me, and then that stupid digigate opened. Honestly, I think they're trying to do that to Parrotmon, too. Hold, hold on, hold on. Because I think I failed to realize something. Is that the giant spider Digimon? Yep. <laughs> yes. <laughs> 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 and all Big that adrenaline. <laughs> With all the little hair on the legs too. Um, Say hey, big man, you want you uh <laughs> mind helping us get out of here? <laughs> well, well, how about how about we try to see if he can can he go back down to like can you go back down to like rookie form or something? Nah, nah, let him let him help us out as a mega. <laughs> you say um, that, but. On the outside world, other Do houses, other people. Joe Kugamon just kind of looks at you and is just like, Look, if you need any help, I'll be happy. I'm just going to find myself a nice dark cave to live in. Oh, that um, works. Yes. Look, look there's, <coughs> we, have, we have a sewer system, you know? No, oh, <laughs> that should be perfect. Can can I ask a a quick question? Yeah, sure, not a problem. What what do you eat? Me. Adiuses. Well, to be perfectly honest, normally I eat small, tiny Digimon that tr fly into my web. But I'm also pretty good at eating meat. All right, all right. Before he passes out, you you get going. All right. Thanks again. Dude. Now I'll always remember your help. Just he try says not that as to he like any people as he jumps up and like breaks open this Faraday cage and then leaves. All right. Wait, aren't we close to a mountain? Look, can you just stay in a cave over there? Maybe, but we gotta get out of here now. Enough questions. We're gonna get out. No, no. no. Um, I, I mean, we should probably tell him that a mountain cave is better than the sewers. Let them eat the gators in the sewers, all right? They need to be cleaned out anyways. So, before we... Well, while they're leaving or whatever, I'm gonna... Because uh, this dude is still here, right? The one you were beating up? Yes. Well, yeah. Out. All right, cool. Is he still conscious? No, he is not. Oh, Darn it. Ken goes over to steal his shoes. I'm not kidnapping the man. <laughs> Actually, can I... Can I, I want to check his body. Okay. Can I take his shoes? They're too small please. for you. Please, I don't care. I, I, you, I have plans. <laughs> you, okay. shoes. you take his shoes. I have shoes. plans. Don't tell Thank me you, you throw him up on the telephone line. <laughs> no. <laughs> Close, but no. But, Lily, you're searching his body, huh? Yes. We're all in the investigation. It's been a very investigative day. Um... You look on him, you find an ID, you find his uh, disc badge, right? And you find a digivice. Did you find his wallet? No, because I heard that <laughs> of Kitty's V-Pet and realized that my V-Pet is over laying on my bed, probably dying. Yeah, I, I, my my unfortunately was asleep, but there was a thing to clean up. So, anywho, so I'm gonna take all that. I I, I bought V pets because I wanted to Digimon. Yes. Did Lily find his wallet? Yes, Lily found his wallet. Lily, take his wallet. I mean, I'm not taking his wallet. Double minds like. Then take the thing inside of it that allows me to get taquitos. I'm going to take the badges and his digivice, and I'm going to throw the wallet back on top of his chest. Does he have an ID that we can use yeah. to get back into yeah. the building if we ever need to? Well, I think he said uh, there was, like, a disc badge and his, like, employee ID. Yes, so you have... Hold on. Lily, you now, in your inventory... Let me add two items for you. Are you ready? Mm-hmm. Disc badge. And... Military ID. What was his name? 
It's Jimmy. <laughs> Jimmy. Um, with his Digivice, can I try to smash it? Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna try to beat it on the ground several times, see what happens. So as you smash his his Digivice, right? Um, you don't notice anything immediately. Did it smash? Yeah, it got destroyed. Hold on, though. I have to t I have to make a note of that. All right, look, we we gotta get out of here now. All right, yeah, yeah. Let's let's go. I am gonna take it with me. What are you taking with you? The broken digi brace. It's like, I don't know if these things, like, regenerate or something. Alright. You take the broken digivice with you. Did he take his shoes? He did. Oh, I took the shoes. <laughs> I have plans for those shoes. Alright. Why are you encouraging this? <laughs> Anyways, you took the shoes. <laughs> Try and find the garage of this place, or a parking lot where they have vehicles. You do find a garage with a couple of disc vans in it. Okay. Um. I can't drive. You can drive. Yeah, that's fine. Just get in Keep the van. The man. Can you drive? Yes. Can you can drive? Yes. <laughs> Daddy, can you drive? Yes. 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 I can drive. I I, Olivia, can you drive? I can drive. I, yes. I can drive. I used to work at an auto garage, so I mean, I can drive. I vote for Olivia. Yeah, I'm <laughs> the responsible one. Let's go. Kudamon's like, actually... don't worry, I've seen her drive. She's only crashed twice. Don't say I that. I legitimately okay. worked on cars for a living. I just want to walk home. <laughs> just get in the van, please. Fine. Holy, Fine. you can't say car. that on a normal basis. <laughs> I'll get in the car. Just... Were there seatbelts in the back? Yes. All, seat of this, uh, all of this sounds <laughs> sus. You have to put on the seatbelts or I'm not driving. <laughs> I mean, I actually, honestly, I thought this was a van, like, there was, like, the two front seats and the back was, like, you know, empty. Yeah, she... it, it, it kind of is, but I'm gonna say that there are... There are seats. There are buckles in the back. Ken's like, wait, hold up, is this the same van that brought us? No. You know what? Hold on. Uh, we're gonna see. We're gonna see if it is. Because all of our stuff was in the other van. That's true. All of your other stuff. Hey, Ken. Yes? High or low? High? It's the same van. <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes! Right, Y'all are going through things. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> I'm gonna climb in the back. I don't care who drives, and I'm gonna so, buckle me and Labramon in. As you all get buckled in, all you go, the thing opens, the truck starts, you know, the truck leaves, go, goes a different direction. Yes, um, like, as, as, no. as, <laughs> Alex, you notice a car. Pulling in roughly after you have left and pulled down a different alleyway. Yeah, no, that's fine. And with that, you all have absconded with a stolen vehicle. That's yeah. where we're stolen military vehicle. <laughs> stolen military vehicle, and that's where we're gonna leave it off for today. Oh. How many felonies did we do? <laughs> so, many. <laughs> so many, so many. So <laughs> many. This is. <laughs> Iris is sitting there like, what the heck? <laughs> I'm not around and you all break the law. But you did it to save a Digimon. That's all that matters. I didn't want to do it. But we <laughs> a, a giant spider Digimon. This right. is what the rest of your life is going to look like, Olivia. <laughs> so, next time I think the most interesting point of view of all of that could be Alex. Alex, you're going to be doing the recap next week. Yeah. I, but I wasn't here most of the time. It's just you're right. Ken. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ken, you get to do your version of the recap next uh, week. Uh, mine would have been like, you know, I woke up to do my pizza shift, you know. <laughs> I got, you know, I got a good tip, I got a bad tip. I met a real douche that spray painted his door. <laughs> well, look, I hope you guys had fun. I know that I did. Uh, yeah. I know there was a long break in there, but I still hope that everybody had a good time today. Um, I tried to make sure that today was full of little story bits. Really quick before we go, how did you guys feel about the the, the story part about pulling uh, Dokugamon out of the portal? I'm that glad cool. that he didn't die. Yeah. Yeah. I wanted to have that themat that kind of that thematic piece from Digimon, just having that like, you know, digivolving to say to, to problem solve, not always to do combat. Yeah. So. I I I think Thaddeus was caught up in the heat of the moment of stuffs going down, bad stuffs going down, and that's why he didn't like register the whole spider thing. And I think. <laughs> and then, and then, once things were like calmed down enough for him to register, like it wasn't bad enough for him to faint, but enough for him to not be okay. That's so funny. But... I don't even know if Thaddeus actually saw the spider. He was passed out. Wasn't he? <laughs> no, no, that's that is why Thaddeus passed yeah. out. Is he saw the giant spider? Oh, right, he did. Yeah. Yeah, he, did. he saw he the did. giant spider, and then he woke back up, saw a cannon beam on, passed back out again. Um. Right. But no, uh, Ken so... just straight up ragdolled a man. <laughs> Half of Ken's recap's gonna be, and then I ate a sandwich. And then I ate <laughs> pizza. And then I punched a guy. <laughs> yeah, Ken, Ken's recap is, is just him eating, you know, so. Alright, guys, this is where I gotta tell y'all about what I had to eat today. Oh, I I'm going to be eating pizza, during the recap. I ate a sandwich. I ate a bear monsoon. I ate some tuna I, fish. I love, how, I love how Brennan's just like, oh no. I'm going to be eating while I do the recap. I'm going to be the guy. And then I did it button. again. Always keep pockets sand. And this is why you always keep pockets sand. Yes. Anyways. I've my lesson. Anyways. And you have to use dirty pocket sand. Anyways. I hope you all enjoyed the stream. I know I did. I know you guys did. I can't wait for next week, which will be a milestone for us. You ready for that awesome milestone? Mm. 20 sessions. Oh, oh wow. hey. Hey, another yeah. Wormon recap. Yeah, if I would ever make those Wormon recap episodes. Um... Wormon's recap is going to have nothing to do with what went on recently. Yeah. <laughs> It'll have nothing to do with whatever. It'll just be, you know, friends, it's me, Wormon. And there I was walking down the street and I didn't see anything, so I just picked up a quarter and said, ooh, shiny. Actually, Wormon's been in this world. No, <laughs> that. Ju just that. That right there, like a little 10 second video <laughs> upload to your channel. That's what his recap is. No, I know it's me. Anyways, but y'all have a good night. Y'all have a good night, and everybody have a good night. And thank you all for watching Digimon Reality. And we will see you all next week, same time, same place. This has been Level Max Plays D and D Digimon Reality. Signing off. Bye. Bye, everyone. Bye. See you guys.